Hello everyone and welcome back to another live stream here on the twitch.tv slash the Asuma. Where we may be joined by another hermit today. To undertake uh, a certain project in a different dimension. I went one floor too far down. Chewy Pepper, thank you for the bananas in chat. Letting us know that we're live. I've been doing projects all over the place. Look, I've got some of my uh, counterfeit diamonds back. And, I don't know, I've just got junk that needs sort of... Well, that's not junk. We'll put that in there for now. Okay, these are empty. And there's everyone else tuning in. Welcome, everyone. Welcome. Got a teeny tiny bit of things to do at the beginning of the stream. I did make notes. Like, repairing the tools was one of them. Getting some more food. And then after that... There's uh, a whole bunch of other stuff. Yeah, getting to this point now where my storage system, right? Like, basically, <laughs> I, I'm just going to have to put the shulker boxes in here, which I've, I've already done with some other materials, so. You know, you know you're getting into a season when that starts to happen. Uh, there you go. So those things will go up there. This will come of us. Button just goes on the floor. Sticks in the wood chest. We've got ender pearls. We've got blocks. We need to go trade with villagers, which might actually help me repair my pick. That's the other thing that I gotta do. Uh yeah, so uh over we go. Which way do we go? Uh Xrom says it's been a minute since you joined. Well, welcome to this stream. Thanks for coming back again. Slightly Lucy said I just woke up for from my nap for this. Oh wow, okay. Summon Sus is here for 44 months. Hope you're having a nice day. I just figured out there's a leak in my car coolant. And I lost my gas cap. Fun start to a day. Dang. Dang. I drove with my, uh, I drove with my gas cap, like, open once. But only for, like, 30 seconds. <laughs> I, w I went to, a, like, a gas pump. Which we don't call it here in the UK. And... Like, the thing wasn't working. Like, there were no signs telling you it wasn't. But it just wasn't, like, taking my card and I was having issues with it. And it, it like, it totally threw me off from the fact that I'd just opened the gas cap to, like, put in petrol. And then I, then I like, drove around in a circle to go back into a different pump. And then when I got out of the car, I was like, oh, oh, naughty. I, uh, I totally forgot to, like, close the cap again. It's one of those things, man, like... You can just so easily be distracted. Look at this, man. These things are great for repairing your tools. Penelope says, good morning, X. It's beautifully early here in Sydney. Super excited for a 26-hour two flights back to the UK. Dang. 26 hours on a plane. Man, the jet lag from that must be... Whew. I was talking uh, yesterday about jet lag, and I was reminded of coming back from New York City, and... Basically, the way it worked out is going there was pretty good. It was just like staying up an extra few hours. But coming back really stretched out and I didn't get any sleep on the plane. No no good quality sleep at all. And then I stayed up to like 10. Right? So I've been asleep, uh, like awake for 36 hours with some very rough sleep in the middle of it. And the next day was actually pretty good. It was actually pretty good the next day. Like I, I think I recovered from that stuff. Pretty quick, but I'm in a 26 hour flight. Whew. Exiled GNR says, can I join Hermitcraft? Sure, dude. The uh, IP address is in the description box down below. Just uh, use that to log on. We'd love to have more people playing. Uh, most people seem to like watching Hermitcraft and not actually playing with us, which I always found a little strange. So uh, if you're interested, dude, man, like, hop right on. Winnie T. Ford says, oh, hi, X and chat. Welcome back, Winnie. Are you still on your, uh, your break from Minecraft? Has Hermitcraft not got, got you the bug again? Uh, let's see. We've got other things that could do with repairing. Like, a little bit of everything. Probably not so necessary, these ones. One by one, we shall make our trades. We shall repair our tools. Here we go. 
Oh, and we're out of pumpkins. I'm guessing regular players are intimidated by the hermits. You're very famous and good players. Oh, thank you. That's high compliments. High praise right there. Intimidation. Maybe that's it. I was wondering if you could give me a random block. I'm making a video kind of like Iskales HT, but with a twist. Um, unless you're standing next to me in the game, I can't give you a random block, dude. Like, you got to be here. You know. I ha how else would I do that? There's no one here. It's just me, right? It's just me. First time watching your stream live. Hello, welcome, welcome. How are you finding it so far? Right, so we've done all of that. I do want to get some carrots as well. So there's more XP for me. They, they really are so OP, these fellas. You lot are OP. Telling you right now, to your face. Super OP. Let's go craft up that. Uh, that goes in there. Then we're going to grab emeralds. Keep stocking them up. Keep stocking them up. <gasps> oh, I had some diamonds in my inventory earlier. What did I do with them? Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I'm going to have to go back to the base for a second here. There was like 14 or 12 of them. I think it was 14. Oh boy. So I haven't messed this up. Is there a redstone world where viewers can share idea of hermits? No, that would be cool though. I mean, I used to have a plot world full of redstone stuff. Those were great times. Great times. Uh, let's see. So. Where? Did I put them in here by mistake? Th th these definitely need more sorting. Uh, but, uh, I maybe put them into... Oh, now I'm confused. I should have had diamonds in my... Oh, do you know what? Do you know what? I think I left them somewhere deliberately. I can go double check. Uh, I should really make some notes then on my Hermitcraft notepad. It was... The original amount was 48. I do not want to lose track of how many diamonds I make this season, you see. Durantic, thank you ever so much for two months of support. Never change, X, you're awesome. Oh, what a lovely message. Thank you. Uh, but, you know, change is the nature of life. I will be a different person to d tomorrow than I shall today. For I will have bestowed myself with the wisdom of this very day. And what have I learned on this day? Uh, don't know. <laughs> I don't know. You learn something every day, apparently, but I don't know what that is. Right, um, yeah, Mr. Vintage Beef was after my assistance with a project and it's a bit awkward to coordinate times and stuff because for me my days are very like rolling one thing into the next and i have only just finished everything else i need to do today and then it's like live stream time and then wind down for the evening after that so ah there you go 14 so 48 plus 14 is the amount of diamonds that i've made so far this season yeah just uh i lost track of where those went. I think I'll just... Yeah, what spot is that? Oh, dang. He's already there? I thought we would have met up or something before. Okay. Yeah, now that I've got it written down, I'm going to do this. And just store my diamonds in here. Okay. Now, I'm going to need rockets and elytra, which actually... That's enough. That's enough rockets. That's fine. I can live with this. That'll get the project done. And I do have an elytra. What I don't have is unbreaking and mending. And we did just get a bunch of emeralds. Let's go fly. Oh, wrong way around. I say fly. 
mean, yeah, I could fly, couldn't I? But it's just over here. We'll take a walk. I like this. I like this shop. Oh, wait. Is this is this Efo shop? I thought this was Joe's shop over here. So it's just it's super simple. Just put some glass blocks out. On top of some stone. I don't know. Somehow, somehow it looks super cool. Love Wells' castle. Castle is looking... Looking mighty fine. So... Oh, they're all gone. Except for you. Oh, uh, there's some over here. Well, dang. I don't know what to make of that. They're all gone. <laughs> the villagers are gone. I guess we'll use these wings sparingly for now. Uh, Kilter Milk, thank you ever so much for... 16 months happy friday x and everyone thank you thank you happy friday to you too this is expanded since i was last there as well i'm glad i didn't rush ahead and build my copper crafting thing in the shopping area i would have not have gone down well I'm sure it would have been fine but that project wouldn't have led anyway uh my chat is not on my other screen Tunkrat says what did i do today i made a, an episode of hermitcraft for y'all Probably going to publish that tomorrow. Kitty Cafe has books. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh, we'll come back to that later. Okay, I'll make a note. I'll make a note. Right, so now, so now we've got to get ourselves to the end. There is, a, there is another means of transport that I've been taking advantage of a lot without my elytra. Which is the old enderpearl. So, like, you can get most of the way over here and, like, free, free throws. Maybe four. Raven Silverwing, thank you ever so much for your subscription. Appreciate it. Thank you. X Hermitcraft episode hype says Jig Rabble. Hey, yeah, you get the hype going. Why don't you build the zombie reinforcement copper farm you built in Season 9, says Butch. Uh, because I built it in Season 9, I guess. Like, It's not that inspiring because I just did it. Like, When you when you do a new thing or solve a problem or do a puzzle, like when something's fresh, it's cool. But when you're doing the same thing again, it's often not. And like every time I thought about doing that farm again, I've just been like a bit eh about it, you know? So I'm I'm not gonna I'm not gonna like do I'm not gonna try and not to prioritize things so much and just keep track of all the things I'm doing. Like yeah, I need to make a cobble farm at some point, but just do what feels like fun. That's been how I've been doing my season so far, and that's I think it's making good episodes. Like I really enjoy putting them together and recording them because it's like less of a plan and more of like following an inspiration. How often do you read chat? Asuma says exile GNR. Never. I, uh, I've, I'm known for never ever reading a single message in my chat. <gasps> oh, dear Lord! Sort it out. Why was I dumped off the side? That is rude. I want these on my hotbar now. Oh. Oh. Okay, and a water bucket. Go on, I'm going to accidentally look at one of these, aren't I? Right. You know how we roll? Uh, we're going to put on... What is it that we're going to pitch? That one. That not, oh, oh yeah, I placed it down the middle now. Right. So. Uh, I kind of know roughly. This doesn't have coordinates. So actually pitch is probably not helpful right now. I want to go sort of this direction. Yeah, okay. right. We'll, we'll take advantage of pitch. 40-40 rule. Alright, up, 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 up by 40. Okay, this is this is almost 40. I need like a macro to do it for me. Oh, I had to had to go a little higher that time. Oh, it's also way better if you're in F5. Yep, 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 yep. Okay, a little F3 check. Uh, this might be it literally right here. So just one rocket to get here. Don't go too close. Don't go too close. All right. 
get rid of that. Oh, there we go. Howdy, good sir. How are you doing? Fantastic. What welcome, are the odds? I just flew over here, you know. <laughs> Bump into I know, another right? hermit. Wow. I know, it's crazy. <laughs> um, okay, so um, do you know what you're doing? <laughs> Me? I'm, I'm, I came here to help. That's all I know. Uh, okay, okay. So, apparently, I've got to build this thing mm -hmm. 10 blocks away from any teleportable teleportable surface. Gotcha, gotcha. Okay, that's, right? that's doable. Yeah, yeah. And, and close enough to an end city so that we can transport the shulkers. Now, mm. do you know how to transport shulkers? I do. I did it. I'll be able to do it again, I'm sure. Oh, okay. It's like, it's okay, like good. a thing you got to do with the minecart and the rail. We'll figure it out. Okay, okay. Um... So I'm gonna have to. So I obviously I got this uh, this design from Flashheart. Ending credits on YouTube. Ending credits. Ending credits on YouTube. It looks really really cool. It supposedly works, but that's when other people build it. I don't know if it's gonna work when I build it. Oh, you'll be fine. <laughs> I'm here to help. I'm here to help. Go Do on. you have Lightmatica? Lightmatica. Yeah. Oh, dude, I would never use such a mod. I don't. I, so I hate cheaty. it. So cheaty. It's terrible. <laughs> Yeah, I got it. <laughs> but I've, I've got to use it for this. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, you always need it for something like that. Yeah. Um, so how should we coordinate this? How's this going to work? What I would do is just find a relatively high point of land, just like over here. Uh, mm -hmm. Well, hmm. Is I mean, that it's too be... far, do you think? Well, yeah, I was going to chop down some of this chorus fruit and put down some scaffolding, but honestly, probably here is fine. Okay. So, like... Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. But then we got all of this stuff over here. So like let's say one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Like if you started on top of that, it will probably be okay, right? Okay, yeah, sure. That's probably good. And if it isn't oh, I d I don't see it being a problem. <laughs> okay. Um I'm really gonna test your patience today. I haven't used this this mod, this terrible mod that shall not be named <laughs> since uh season eight. And wow. I used it very, very sparsely in season eight. Very sparsely. So okay. it's gonna be a little difficult for me. I might be a little slow on the uptake at times. That's fine. Could you send me the uh the lightmatic itself? I could drop it into my game and load it at the same time you load it. Then we can have yeah, it in yeah, the same perfect. place. Okay. Okay. Let's I'll do get that. on that. And I'm I'm streaming, so I'm gonna I'm gonna mute occasionally just to say thank no you to problem. people and stuff. Uh, Van Hart twenty one, thank you so much for seventy five months bringing Let's Evil X here. into his house. There's our animation. Schematics. Yeah, I just gotta grab this schematic from Thief. All right. There it is. Uh huh. All right, I got it. All these, oh goodness, all these uh, Endermen walking oh, around. Oh yeah, yeah, look down. Nervous. We should probably make I a know. little pool of water nearby, like, so you can jump into it. And then they Yeah, can't... that's not a bad idea. I'll do that here. Do you awesome. have a bucket with you? There'll be two in here. Okay. Uh, wait, it's in the toolbox, yeah. Whoa. Okay. One, two, three, four, five. We'll make it like five by five wide. A nice wide area to find refuge in. Okay, I've got right. I've got the schematic. I think a good idea would be to go on top of here to place it. Perfect water bucket. Uh huh. Right. Now here's the bit I don't like because I don't want to look around, so I'm going to use free cam. Another cheaty mod. <laughs> We're full of cheaty mods today. Where did this thing go? Uh, ah. Uh, oh my god, it's massive. It's it's big. Woo! Actually, I'll it's tell you big. what. No, no, it's it's not that big. Okay. I've seen bigger Good. farms. <laughs> Good. Okay. I've got to configure it for you, and then I'll send you a screenshot. There should be some sort of a way to, to do a cooperative like Matica builds. That would be cool, yeah. A little, little share yeah. button and then it just oh, sends it over to you. Yeah. Right, so the purpose of the screenshot that I'm going to send you 
orientation. Yeah, you're going to have the X, Y, and Z coordinates to ah, load up, gotcha. right? Okay, so yep. you press M to load like Madoka. Mm -hmm. Then in the configuration menu, set the layer to 112 just so it will render the whole thing for you. Okay. Also, do you have my stream open? Because then you could sort of see the mod in action that way too. Oh, that's true. I could do that. Let me do that real quick. This is wild. Okay. Alright, you tuned in? I am. So, in the Light Matica menu, the configuration menu um, is where you set the layer. That allows you to see everything. Mm -hmm. What you'll need to do is go into load schematics. Ah, okay, yep. And then if you've put the file in the schematic folder, you should see piston shuffling. Yeah, yeah. Uh, that part I'm good on. Load schematic. Uh, then after what happens after that? I don't want to. Oh, I've loaded it twice now. And now I have to. You've got to go to schematic placements configure and then yep. you'll see all the numbers and stuff yeah uh, reload unload hold on load schematics where's the configure oh, have you gone have you menu? gone through the load schematic uh, menu yet yes yes I already see it on my screen then it's schematic placements in the, in the same menu so just like exit whatever you're in, go back into Lightmatica, and then it's like the top left one. Oh, okay, gotcha. And then in there you click on configure, and then mm -hmm. you set those coordinates that I just gave you. Okay. Okay. Right, I think... Hopefully. It might be a little bit, or probably being paranoid, it might be a little bit too close to these, so just going to chop them down. Okay. But you can see the ghost building in, in like the sky here now, right? Yep, yep, yep. Awesome, awesome. Yeah, so now, now we've got to start placing some of the blocks. One of the tricky things yes. will probably be um, the order in which you place some of this stuff, because it's got think like bud power systems going on actually i don't know it looks looks like it's going to be not too bad at all i mean i guess we work at it like row by row because it's it's all kind of separate or column by column is that the proper thing yeah uh i w i don't know we'll figure out as so we go brought, along so you got you yeah. got all the materials right i i did except it's very expensive prismarine build and i just brought um i brought just stone brick stairs instead. Got ya. Got ya. Yeah. Um, okay, so do you have scaffolding as well? I did not bring that. Uh-oh. I have a limited it's amount. Meat. Okay, to the water. <laughs> to the water. <laughs> <laughs> That'll save ya. There we go, there we go. Oh boy, Take that this is gonna out. be annoying. <laughs> you know, I haven't even started building this thing and I know I'm never gonna build another one for the rest of my I, life. I, once you get shells out of it, you might change your mind. Ah, uh, I guess. So are you starting there then? Yeah, I figured at this height you can kind of use the scaffolding and place the slabs. And then the you know pistons what do? are facing upwards. I mined some end stone. I'm just going to start on the other end with end stone just straight up so that it makes it um, just a little bit easier for me. So in each row here, is it a col It's a column. If it's vertical, it's a column. That's correct, yeah. So it is, uh, okay, just a lot of glass, some pistons, uh, okay. Yeah, the observers are facing downwards, so you'll place some junk blocks, then you'll place the redstone. Right. I, I think the best way to do this is in batch. So, like, if you start by just putting in all the slabs and pistons, you're sort of doing the same little thing over and over again. Mm -hmm. Should make it a little easier to... Um... Yeah, that's a good idea. Yeah, I, I think I'm also going to place the slabs... Like, and then break them. Like, there'll be a bunch. Yeah. Hard to describe, really. <laughs> okay, this is going to be fantastic. I'm sure nobody's going to die at any point. 
As long as we're prepared. Yeah. <laughs> you got your wings on. Just got to, if you fall off, tap space. We're that's not true. over the void, that's which true. is These good. aren't even... These aren't even my wings. I had to borrow them from the end busting Oh, kit. wow. Okay. I know. This is because you got the permit, right? You've been forced to do something a little different. Yeah, exactly. Which is fun. It's definitely fun. It's, it's cool seeing people go out of their comfort zone and uh, do oh, yeah. things. All right. So this goes here and then... Uh, Nordican, thank you ever so much for 33 months. Appreciate it, my dude. Ishan is here for two. The Vixen 38 for 61. You both could wear your ministry hats. It is kind hats. of annoying that <laughs> it's going to give us the red incorrect block placement because of uh, the different slabs I'm using. Yeah, I wouldn't worry too much about that. Like it, it visually, it's a bit annoying, but you'll get you'll get used to it. Um, I just had an interesting suggestion come through. We both mm -hmm. have ministry hats. And I yeah. believe that those pumpkins let you look at Enderman, don't oh, they? You're right. I didn't bring my hat. Oh, what? Dang. <laughs> I wasn't prepared to minister today. Oh, we are ministering things in the end. Right, I'm going to grab mine and give it a try. Uh, I'm, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to risk it. Oh, my God. Yeah, I just guess. like look straight at the Enderman and they're like, nah, not interested in you. They're like, you have a really cool hat. I'm not going to bother you. Exactly. It's probably because I'm as tall as them <laughs> with the hat. It's a little extra <laughs> yeah, height. Right. They're like, oh, yeah, you're one of us, are you? Oh, that's good. Oh, this... I think this is going to go relatively smoothly. Yeah, no, it usually is. Like, once you're up here, you know... The, the, I think yeah, one... if you accidentally look at an Enderman when you're facing downwards, they might teleport up here. That's like your one risk. Yeah. We'll see. So, Beef, did you see the new wolves that got added to the game? I did. I'm very excited. So, wait, are these going to work kind of like the cats then? Like, kind of, they just spawn out in the wild like that? Cats cats are a little more um, quirky because they spawn in villages, right? Right. These are just going to spawn at all sorts of different biomes. Some of them will be the same biome that the previous wolf spawned at, and some of them will be ones where they didn't spawn before. Okay, so here's what. So when you tame them, I mean they're so they're spawning with those colors, correct? Uh, yeah. No, no, no when not you like, tame them, they yeah, they're like that before you tame them. Right, and then they just keep their their coloration after you tame them. Correct. Yeah, and it's cool. it's based on what biome they spawn in, right? So yeah, you can go you can go hunting in different biomes for uh, different wolves, which I think is cool. Yeah, I'm excited about that. I, I, for a long time, I've been wanting different... I think I even mentioned that this season, I was like, oh, how about like a different uh, colored dog? That'd be great. I read, the, I read that on the feedback website that it was like the number one thing that they hadn't added. Oh, really? Yeah, because they've added a few things recently that were number one on there. So it seems like they're, they're ticking things off the list and Wolves was next, I guess. It doesn't really surprise me. I mean, dogs are pretty popular. Yeah, absolutely. Like no one, no one complained about the cats getting a bunch of new skins, right? Exactly. And I'm, you know what? I, there's a little bit of a little bit of uh, trivia about me, I guess. I used to be such a dog person until I got a cat. And oh, now, interesting. Yeah, I love cats. <laughs> you still love dogs, though, right? Get, still love dogs, absolutely. I still have two, and I have zero cats right now, unfortunately. But um, yeah, I got one cat. He was only with us for a short time, and he had uh, a terrible disease. So oh. unfortunately, didn't last long. But such a, a cool guy. Like it, he was so awesome. Like a, like a social cat, or like because some cats just don't let you get near them. They like to be very independent. So I think maybe that's why I really liked him, is because uh, with my wife. He was very mean and aggressive. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Which, not good for her, but it was kind of funny to see. Uh, but with me, he loved me so much. Like, I used to just sit on the couch, and he would come and, like, curl up on my chest and snuggle up against my beard. Fascinating. That's cool. Yeah. Yeah. It so it's like, awesome. he, he like he, like, picked you out of the two. Yeah. Interesting, yeah. Yeah, I, uh, I have a doggy in my life. I, I walk my sister's dog on a regular basis. Oh, nice. What kind and, of dog is it? Uh, 
I'm not really good with the breeds, um, but I know okay. that he's... Is it hypoallergenic? Oh, good. Yeah. Yeah, and he's the sweetest little dog who will... Like, he doesn't bark, and he just licks your face. And he's cute. <laughs> yeah. Um, he wags his tail, like, whenever he sees you, and loves going on a walk, and just nothing but good, good vibes. Yeah. And my favorite yeah. thing to do when I'm looking after him is to just lay down on the ground and he like freaks out and comes over and starts like licking my face and <laughs> sniffing yeah. me and stuff. It's so cute. Uh -huh. Yeah. <laughs> it's like the ultimate and way to be stressed. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah. Cool. No kidding. I, I mean, yeah, I have two. I have a English bulldog, which is, he's 10. Um, and for an English bull, he, well, technically he's almost, he's 10 and a half. So he's, he's getting up there. English bulldogs lifespan is usually eight to 10 years. So I'm super happy with how well he's done, but he's kind of like a little, he's like, a, I describe him as a bag of sand. He just, <laughs> he just lays there yeah, without yeah. doing anything else. Um, so yeah, he's something. But then my other dog that I got, he's younger. He's going to be four. He's a, uh, a long haired German shepherd. He's a big boy, but he is just so full of energy. And I yeah. don't understand why. Like he's, He's getting to the age where he should be calming down. He also has been neutered. Um, I don't know why he's so rambunctious. I have no <laughs> idea. But he is. And he he's so destructive, too. That's another thing. So at four years, well, you'd expect them to, like, calm down a little. Exactly, when, when they're puppies, especially... they can be wild, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. And then we also we even took him to... Uh, he had professional training done and everything. And wow. still, <laughs> not really having it. I mean, some people are just born, you know, they got that energy, they got that spirit. Yeah, yeah. He's, we call, he, he does something interesting when we let him out because he's got his own little space in the house. He spends all day in the house um, and then a couple hours a day out in the, we have like a big property. So he spends it out in the, um, I don't even know if it's considered a yard. It's, it's huge. Um, oops, oh! almost, di almost died, it's fine. I saw that. Uh, um, I was just going to say, but, like, um, this is like a little walkway for us to get around, so we might want to remove blocks here last, if that makes sense. That's true. Yeah, I should have probably not removed these. Hmm. It's all right. Okay. We'll, we'll just place them all. Um, yeah. The next thing, now that we put that first layer in, I think is to get some temporary oh. blocks. Let's see what you got here. Uh, let's split up these observers. I have a bunch of, um, endstone that I was mining. You can use that as temporary blocks for the observers. That could work, yeah. Put them in your inventory. Uh, looking at this. Oh, and then we got, ah, uh, then we got a downwards piston at the top. That's going to be annoying. Is it? Oh, it's at mm. the top. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah, there's going to, so it's going to be like... Placing, if you got my if you got my stream open again, like this might be handy. Yep. It's gonna be like we got to get that redstone block in place, then place the observer below it, then go back on top for all the glass. Then you yeah. gotta do something similar for the piston. So I think building one of these columns at a time all the way to the top makes. Yeah, uh, I makes think that's a good idea. To me, yeah. Unless, hmm. We could actually, we could go to the top and build all of the slabs with redstone on first, and it might make placing the piston a little easier. That's true. I think true. that way. Yeah, I think that way. Okay. Okay. So we need more slabs. More slabs. We should have enough. Uh, oh, uh, we're, we're going to run using, out. Yeah. You were using them for walkways. Yeah. Okay. Don't worry though. I got us. I got us sorted. You got a supply. Yes. There we go. Slab supply. <laughs> Always. Uh, have you? Oh, you're over there. Okay. Oh, I, I got yeah. more. We'll, we'll be near each other. And then, then we need redstone. So I'm going to put these observers and stuff back. Oh, are the redstone blocks just to uncraft into redstone? Uh, Yes. Uh, so I brought more redstone blocks than I needed, but we do need a bunch of... I think we need 80 redstone blocks. Nice. And then the rest, redstone powder. I've just been raided by Joe as well. Hey. Thank you, Joe. We're totally not using cheaty mods like Light Matica. Yeah, have necessary. you seen what Joe's been up to? Like, building, like, a massive mega project? I haven't, no. Oh, it looks super interesting. And interesting. I noticed that it's got loads of ice, and I was like, I need to go over there and 
pinch some ice. Uh, I don't know. Is he online? No, he's, he's logged off already. I've been meaning to ask if it's okay to pinch ice. <laughs> I love pinching ice. <laughs> Uh, Prixel25, thank you for nine months. Father of Apocalypse, thank you for 47. Thank you again, Joe, for the raid, and uh, welcome, everyone. Picking ice. I hate, like, Matica. I have to be honest with you. I I, I think it's... Ha I, I've got mixed feelings on it. Like, it's handy, but also it becomes a crutch. It can take away your creativity. But It's definitely handy, yes. Are you but... saying you hate it because of how it looks? Yeah, it's not intuitive. To me, it, it's not, it, it doesn't feel, none of this feels natural. <laughs> yeah, it definitely takes it's some so weird. used to. The way, it, the way it renders visually, I do wonder if there could have been like better methods or, or something. Mm -hmm. But, you know, sometimes you just got to work with what's available. I'm 100% confident that at some point I'll think there's an actual block there and I'll walk over it and just fall. <laughs> That's highly likely. Yeah. And about redstone. Right. Yeah, that's that bit. Did you bring any repeaters? Um, I have repeaters in my uh, shulkers, yes. Okay. We also got but to put down a couple me. of repeaters, yeah. Yeah, one of the things that helps is holding down shift. Because then yeah. you're not going to yeah, like, walk off the edge, yeah. Oh, Which way should here? I be going? This way. Oh. What type of clock is this? This is... I don't know. <laughs> Looks interesting, though. Oh, did I miss a spot there? I did. Oh, I see. I, I, was, I was like, why is there soul sand here? I'm not sure if this thing has an on-off switch. It might just continue um, to be around. Yeah. Not a bad thing, though, because it's mostly going to be unloaded. One thing we've got to do, I must remember, is to mark this area so it doesn't get pruned. Right. Yes. That's a good point. <laughs> yeah. Pruning pruning the world is like an annoying thing that you have to do. Otherwise, the world just gets ridiculously big. And that's uh, not great. Oops. That is not it. Did you have more of those blocks on? Oh, you're using a different, uh, okay. Oh, what happened? Am I using a different one to you? I think so. I just went with the same ones we used down below. Oh, no, 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 never mind. It's the same. It's just the throwing me off because you put redstone on these already. And so it has like a different yeah. uh, color over them. So that's fine. <laughs> I think I'm out of that. So I'm better. Is there more redstone in the box? I'm assuming there is. Well, I got some here too. Actually, you know what? I'll leave you to the redstone at the top, and then I'll start making these columns one by one. Okay, yeah, yeah. Uh, i got to bring the uh, repeaters up here, too. This is also my first time this season using an elytra, so I'm always nervous when jumping off. I have to double check. <laughs> yeah, dude, I've been doing it the other way around. I've been, like, jumping off of things and tapping space so I could swoop, and then it's like, oh, no, no, bang, hit the ground. <laughs> hasn't killed me yet, but it's such an annoying reflex from last season. Uh, Eric Chieftain, thank you so much for two months of support, my dude. Thank you for supporting the channel, and I uh, hope you enjoy the stream today. My chat is asking, is is this uh, my farm or yours? It's, it's your farm, right? Technically, it's, it's my farm, but, I mean, if you're helping me build it, you are now half owner of this farm, and you are entitled to free shelters for the rest of your life. Dang, I was I was just gonna be like, can I can I get a few shulkers, please? I'll take free shulkers. <laughs> Absolutely. Did That'll I be mighty that? dandy. I didn't think so. So what price are you thinking oh. of selling these at? That's a good question because technically, I can charge anything I want. <laughs> yep. <laughs> right? Isn't it weird though? It I is. was selling XB yesterday, so XB has all the food for his shop, and I'm helping him stock his shop, and I literally, I told him, like, you don't have to charge this. He was charging, like, two diamonds per stack of golden carrots, and I told him, you know what? 
You can, you can bump it up another diamond. I think it'll be fine. Yeah, I'll probably get away with it. Yeah, it's, I mean, it's all it's all just unknowns, really, isn't it? Like, we don't know yeah. how all of this is going to play out. So it's fun to experiment and try stuff and do things different, I think. It's exciting. I like it. I would have never done something like this had I not gotten that permit, so. And imagine doing this without, without like, a lightmatic thing. Like oh, trying to, trying to could. figure out. <laughs> I know. It's. I mean, that's how I do things now. Is just like I build it first, and then I I just copy it. It just takes such a long time. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's why that's why Lightmatica came about, right? Because people got used to doing stuff in creative because it takes less time, and then mm -hmm. now you want to be able to transfer that across. I, I do think it's a problem with this game. I think I think it's worse with building because building could be better in survival. Right. But the fact that you want to go between creative and survival to make stuff i think says that survival could be better at doing that yeah player. i think so do you have any more uh scaffolding by the way just a little bit yep uh okay, whereabouts are you uh, i'm back down on the ground here i will just throw it down okay okay let's uh, actually try not to throw it on anything yep this will work here we go nice <laughs> pretty close to where i was yeah, I'm, all, I'm almost yes. done with this redstone now, too. Okay. Yeah, it's really, anno it's really annoying how it highlights, like, blue. Yeah. And then you're just not sure where else you play stuff. Oh, missed one. Okay, so now I have to place the redstone block. And then the observer. There we go. Okay, one column down, about 70 to go. <laughs> nice. <laughs> yeah, that's all the redstone. And then need repeaters. Right, where am I falling? Over there. There's a convenient pool of water over here. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Forgot about that. Oh, well, that's all. Oh, oh, oh. It's like playing a game of dropper. Nailed it. Going for all these obstacles. Uh, repeaters. Yes, we've got those. I guess I've got to build that little clock, too. So that's some soul sand. Ah, uh, what else was it? Torch. Yeah, an observer, two buttons. I think the buttons are to stop things from teleporting to it. I think so, yeah. Oh, and a lever there. Interesting. Huh. It's a bit of a, it feels like a strange spot to have the lever. Right, lever, slabs, the observer, that was the one. Should I make a group? A group could be smart, yeah. Yeah, I'll do that. Cool. Rathgar asks, will I be taking 50% like everyone else? You, you offer me free shulker shells? I will absolutely take that. I don't need no diamonds. <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. Uh, oops. Hey, there we go. This is, um, I think, I think this is going to go so much quicker now because I'm kind of used to <laughs> what I need to place and when. So I'm going to fly through these. You're getting, yeah, you got that like repetitive yeah, thing yeah. going on. Yeah. That's why I thought doing the top bit would help because then you can just place that piston easy and mm -hmm. shift off to the side and yeah. Right, soul sand next. Let's see. Oh, uh, <laughs> before I get, yeah, I might be about to activate everything. I'm not sure if I want to do that. Oh. Uh, I need to get. Oh, this is so awkward. <laughs> Where are you? You're over there. Yeah, I'm on the other side. Hello from. Can I get some of that scaffolding back, or are you using it? Oh yeah, yeah, you can. Uh, 
Can I just throw it down? That's a piece of redstone missing. I will. Yeah, no, I'll come down. I'll come over to you. Okay. Actually, I'm not sure that's going to work. Actually, no, I'll tell you what, don't worry about it. It won't work because uh, scaffolding only okay. goes like so far across, doesn't it? Hmm. Uh, should I do this in a specific order? No, I'm just going to do it in whichever one's closest. Okay, where are we over there? So I think this lever that I'm placing right now, I think that's the on-off switch for the whole farm. Okay. It, it seems really odd because I'm, I'm going to guess like they built the farm in creative, so they're sort of just used to flying to it. I see, yeah. Because it is not conveniently placed. But and how are we going to get up there after? Well, I guess ladders, you, nothing... Uh, as long as we have, yeah. It's a just and rockets, stuff, yeah. maybe. Oh, do you know what? You can probably land somewhere up here on top of the redstone. Right, yeah, that's true. And then true. Hit, hit its hitbox below the block. Yeah, that seems to be the way. But yeah, yeah imagine you'd probably just leave this thing running and then just... Yeah. You know, fly over here, use it for a bit, fly back. I don't know how the storage system works on this. <laughs> it's a mystery to all of us. You might, you might want out. to build like a uh, shulker box loader or something. So, you, in fact, you could have it automatically craft the shulker boxes too if you wanted to. Oh, wow. Now we're getting technical. As yeah, if this wasn't got, technical enough. We've got the craft of this season, right? Oh, dang it. I didn't bring some buttons. Oh, they're in my... You mean up with you, right? Yeah, I'll go grab them. Uh, what are we building? Just joined the streams. Is funny too much. This is a shulker farm. A brand new design as well. Beef, tell them how it works. You I mean, you put so much time and effort into making this. Oh yeah, yeah. So what happens is, the shulkers are in the farm, <laughs> and then they create shulker shells so that you can farm them. Just like that. Nailed it. Just like that. <laughs> Isn't don't you have to don't you have to put yourself in this farm if I remember correctly? Like you gotta stand in it at some point. Um, maybe. I think once it's built, I'm gonna do a little bit more reading and looking into it. That'll be a good idea. Oh no, am I out of glass? I am. Okay, that's fine. Oh, good news. The top area is done. That's nice. Okay, good. There. I've got about uh, five columns, six columns done. Nice. I guess I could just fly up there. Oh, this is this is what I mean. Just not used to Elytra stuff yet. I'm trying. Uh, like, even though I've got my Elytra on now, because, you know, hazardous times and whatnot, I'm really going to try not to use it this season. Uh, me too, actually. I'm really enjoying kind of traveling by horseback and... Just seeing everybody and just having interactions along the way wherever yeah. I'm going. So much fun, isn't it? Yeah. I think we should just ban Elytras. <laughs> Jemmy would be gutted. He's got the Elytra shop. Like, <laughs> That's right. Goodbye business plan. Yeah, well. All's fair and love and business. <laughs> All the way up here. Okay. Oh, do you know what? You could do like four of these at once if you just go up in the middle. Ah, oh, that's that's the way. Oh, dang it. Now you tell me. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe even five. Now that's pushing it. I think, I think once I've got a couple of these in, I might even turn off the uh, schematic overlay. Oh, that's that's brave of you. Not yeah, me. don't don't want to make any mistakes, but it's like kind direction. of predictable where they are. That's true. I mean, every single one of them is exactly the same. Exactly. Yeah, you're right. This is a lot easier with... I just did four of them. 
Yep. Not four uh, completely, but started four of them. If you go up in the middle of a set of four, mm -hmm. uh, then you ah. can reach all of them at the same time, is kind of my thinking. Made my first mistake. Apparently Doc and Joe have been uh, chatting about building a monorail system. Interesting. That could be cool. Thing is, we that, tried that. that. We tried cool. that in season six. All right. Uh, HRN. I don't think I was in. What, wait, when did I come back? I think I four. came back season seven. Oh, right. Yeah, yeah. You I went skipped away the season. I was no, four you were in or season five. five. Yeah, oh, yeah. yeah then you skipped season six. I see. Yeah. Yeah, no, we had it. the The issue was, it's the same. It's the same thing with like the elytras, right? Except we got a little momentum not to use the elytra. But I think horses are really quite fast, so you know they're speedy. Whereas the rail, not as flexible. Not so speedy. Yeah. Not so speedy. And oh, no. HRM was really cool to have in the world, but didn't get used at a crazy amount. There we go. There's the second set of four. Nice. Oh, wow. You're flying through them. So what do you have planned for the rest of the season or things you want to... Well, I am going to uh, I'm gonna live a nice, quiet life. I've been trying to live a nice, quiet <laughs> life, but with neighbors like Iskal, you know, yeah. it's always difficult. But yeah, I just want to uh, continue my little farm life. I'm going to make um, all 100% uh, natural organic farms to supply XB with all the materials he or the all the food he needs for his shop nice. and we're gonna split the profits so that's good too for me um, after this I've already made a basalt generator in the nether oh did you get the basalt permit I did yeah yeah and I've got the book and quill permit so I gotta I think I gotta build a squid farm because I'm gonna need a lot of ink for the book and quill and, and I do have a chicken and farm yeah, yeah. So I do have a chicken farm for the feathers, and then yeah, leather. I'll I'll need a, a a cow farm as well, which is fine because I need to provide XB with uh, meat feet. What 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 feet? am I looking for? Meat <laughs> steak. steak. <laughs> that was a, that's the one. That was a difficult word to remember, I guess. Um. So yeah, I mean, I'm just gonna build a bunch of farms. It's gonna be good, and they're try all, not to lag the server out too much. They're they're sort of related to farming. I mean, at least the cows and the chickens will be. Yeah. Not so, not so sure about the squid, but... <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, squid farms are probably a thing, right? <laughs> Actually, yeah. I think in I think in IRL, they do fish farming, right? Like... Mm-hmm. I already have, like, a little salmon farm. It's not very effective, oh. but it's provided me with a five or six stacks of salmon so far, so that's not bad. That's awesome. Wait, wait. We, we're Sorry, are we talking in-game or, like... In game, in game. Not, not. <laughs> Stacks threw me off. Like it, I was thinking, all right, okay, Beef's got a little aquarium. He's got salmon in there. He's, he's I used cooking to be them really up. into uh, into aquariums, actually. Oh wow, okay, that's cool. Yeah, I haven't done it in a long time, though. Yeah, I've seen uh, I've seen some of the there's there's things like that that you can really get into. Um, I think Ren showed me one where you build little like habitats inside of. Uh, you know, just a just a glass, like a big, really big glass bottle, and mm -hmm. they create like ecosystems in there. And create yeah, these... yeah, those are really cool. Yeah, that that kind of thing, I guess. Just, I just used to have, like, I think I had in my old place before I moved. I had three 120 gallon tanks that I kept wow. cichlids in. Yeah, it was really cool. I loved it. Dang, you've always been into animals, then. I have, yeah, actually. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah, yeah, I've always, I've always uh, loved animals, but just like never, never really had pets and and whatnot. So they're a lot of work. Now that I'm getting a little older, uh, I don't think I would do it again in yeah. terms of having animals. Because I mean, they're great, but there is very little. They rob you a lot of your, your freedom, unfortunately, because you can't really travel as much as you want. If you want to go, even if you want to do like an overnight stay you have to think about what are you doing with your pets yeah it's like having a kid they're, they're exactly. your responsibility so, 
Yeah, so it's not the best, especially since we're wanting to travel now, my wife and I, so it's uh, it's complicated. We have not only the dogs, but the donkeys and yeah. the goats as well. So it's something. We, we, off, oh, yeah, and we, we got, like, a, a neighbor to um, come and help us with them the last time we went away, but it, she told us some things. She was, like, a 16-year-old girl. And she told us some stuff when we got back. My wife was not happy with. So no. she's like, yeah, maybe we're not leaving the animals with that particular yeah. neighbor anymore. Oops. Because you got to trust them, too. Not only do you have to get somebody to take care of them, feed them, you got to trust these people. Yeah, trust them to do the right thing. Exactly. That's not always the case. So with animals, it's like sometimes you, you might have had plans, but guess what? you got to go take care. Of this thing now. Yep. I used to just, um, when I lived away from my parents and I visited them, I would just stay stay for the night and drive out in the morning. That is not the case anymore because I have to get back to the animals. So it's got to be a same day thing. Oh, yeah. Yeah. But yeah, I want I, I think I want to have a dog one day, but like just right now, my time, I'm always. You know, doing this, doing that. I'm always busy, and yeah, just don't see how like having a dog would get into it because you. I know you just got to give them a lot of your time, right? Like you can't mm -hmm. neglect them. They they're gonna need things. They're gonna have trips to the vet or whatever. And... Oh yeah, oh yeah. That that's a whole other ball game in terms of expenses. I had a a, a French bulldog who had so many health issues. I swear, I probably could have bought a house. With the amount of money I spent on her, it's uh, it was ridiculous. I mean, she was totally worth it, right? She's like a member of the family, um, but it's it can get very very expensive, and yeah. depending on what part of the world you're in too, it can get super expensive. Because I know Canada, the um, the vets here, there's like really no regulations. They can kind of charge whatever they want. Oh, interesting. So yeah, we're kind of at their mercy. I have no no experience with uh, veterinarian bills, but I can imagine there is pet insurance you can get. But that wasn't really a thing when I uh, when I got my French bulldog. I should have in hindsight, but it was kind of like a new thing when I got her, and so a lot of a lot of people were kind of hesitant, like, "Ah, oh, pet insurance? Will they really cover everything?" And yeah, I definitely should have got pet insurance. Yeah, the thing with insurance is like. It's a good idea, but you know it's always better for them if yeah. they, you know, get away with n not paying, basically. So, like, there's a built-in incentive, although they're providing you with it. Like, they are, they're playing the numbers, and every time they don't have to pay up for a case, it's better for them. So, mm -hmm. I, yeah. I have, like, you know, house insurance and stuff, and... And I, like, you know, you just see that little amount there every month in your bank account, and I'm always thinking, I like... <laughs> You know, I never, never have to use this. Is it really yeah. worth paying? And then I know. I mean, we had. Uh, I've obviously always had house insurance as mandatory here. I think it's not mandatory in some countries, so I don't know if it is there or oh, not. But I don't know actually. I just just went with it. Yeah. Um. So I'd never used it, and I'd always thought it was a scam until we had a flood in the basement, Ooh. and it destroyed a bunch of things, and so. They actually replaced the cost of all those things, no questions asked, which was, well, definitely questions asked, but they didn't make a big deal out of it, which was nice. Like, they didn't fight us on it. Um, so that was definitely handy to have on that occasion. But that is the one and only occasion I've ever used it. Mm. Yeah, no, that, that's, I mean, that must have saved you a massive headache. Like, Definitely, yeah. Uh, what well, about three over here? This is going pretty well. Yeah, I didn't think it would take too long, but we've got to get a shulker over here too. That actually I know, was that's like, the part that I'm worried about. That was the fastest pass la last time I did it, but I can't remember if there was anything... Oh, I'm sure there was something special about how I grabbed it. I think what I'll do is just go find that old episode and rewatch that moment because I'm pretty sure you have to arrange the rail in a particular way to grab the shulker. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. Is, uh, I don't know, like some, some mobs are a bit obnoxious when it comes to getting them in a boat or a minecart, right? Mm-hmm. 
Okay. Yeah, I'll look up. I'll look it up too. I'll look up some tutorials or something on, on the old YouTube. Oh no, I, 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 I'll look it up because I know exactly where to go. It's like I literally did this in one of my episodes. Gotcha. So if I go yeah, look yeah. it up, like bam, there we are. Okay. Sounds good. I hope I brought. I think I, I, I think I had the exact right amount of materials, but you never know. And it's always a good idea to uh, bring a little extra, just in case. Yeah, I know. I was struggling though. I, I haven't collected very much stuff this season so far, so. Me neither, man. I um, I was just <laughs> finished doing like a redstone project earlier today, and I I was literally using the very last pieces of redstone, and I was like, oh, this, this was cutting it fine, you know. Otherwise, I would have had What's... to gone caving and stuff. I was just going to say, it's a good thing, because I messaged you earlier saying, I don't think I have enough redstone. And then, as I was waiting for you, I went caving some more, and got some more, luckily, because I did not have enough. Yeah. And hopefully I do now. Time will tell. I'm running out. I'm running out here, actually, as it goes, now that you mention it. Uh, so how many... Let me... I'm going to turn off the schematic, and... Oh, we're, we're real close. We're real close here. Whoa, that is not what I was supposed to do there. Yeah, I think we're close. Where did that piston go? Uh, it did. Ekrom of Zero, thank you for two months of Sleeping Hippo. Thank you for subscribing. <laughs> and Wiggly Fox, thank you for 48 bucks. more redstone Appreciate blocks. it. Thank you, thank Let's, you, thank you. Oh, we do. Nice. Okay. Take another bit of glass. Do you need any more redstone blocks? I got one redstone block. <laughs> Here, I'll put, I put eight in there for you. I oh, think, nice. hopefully, that's all we need. Hey, Brooksy96. Thank you ever so much There's for 71 months these. bringing Evil X to the his house. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I got a question in my chat asking how much of a difference... In difficulty between Shulker Farm in the end versus Overworld. Uh, the difficulty is just that you'd have to take the Shulker to the Overworld. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, I think these things pretty much work the same in both dimensions. I think Doc... I don't know where... I think he built one already this season. Yeah, he, he just... You know, going full tilt building all the mega farms like straight out of the, uh, yeah. out of the gate. Yeah. But I wonder where he built his. Was it Overworld or, or in the end? I think he put it in the Overworld. Last, yeah, I think last season he put it in the Overworld. He asked for my help um, getting it there. But I, literally all I had to do was like stand in a specific place and hit a switch or something when <laughs> when yeah. The, uh, yeah when it got there. So wasn't super helpful. He, he built one last season. I think he built one in Season 8. <laughs> Probably builds them every season. He's been giving away shelters for free, totally violating the permits. Oh, that's cheeky. That's cheeky. I know. I'll get him. Submit oh. a complaint to the permit office. I've heard bad things about that place. Yeah, me too. Long waits, a lot of paperwork. Underfunded. <laughs> <laughs> you should volunteer there. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, there's two more over there still. I think I'm out of pistons, though. I don't know if there's any more in the... I got um... four. Okay, then Are you're... you near me? I don't think so. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm making my way down as I place blocks, so... Uh, if you can spot me. Uh, I can, yep. Oh, you're like... Okay, right. <laughs> you're all the way down. Wait, I... Fr oh, No! <laughs> I threw the glass. Thanks for the glass. Do you need more glass? Oh, I've got to come back and get it. Yeah, yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh, well, that was smart, wasn't it? So, wait a minute. How many pistons? There's four pistons. Here's the glass. Well, do you need do you need any glass? Cause... Oh, wait a second. I will need some glass. Yeah, here, have okay. half my glass. Is there any more in here? Yeah, look, I think, there I think... is no more. Here, take, take, take that. I think, uh, okay. I think I've got enough because I took a stack. So if there's four pistons, there should only be four of these left, right? But, oh, but you already did. Oh, okay, gotcha. Never mind. What What will probably be helpful is to take off the light matica 
and like fly well not fly around like look around at yeah what's left because I'm, I'm doing three of them just here okay i've got two uh in my sights here okay i guess we'll go through here yeah it's getting to that point where we need to uh just figure out what's actually left the middle part with the prismarine without the prismarine yeah i'm seeing okay i've got one missing in this cluster uh next cluster's good so is that one and the one that you're in right now i think you're doing the last two there is that correct yes why is that red is that piston huh there's a couple pistons here that are red for some reason. In the light Matica thing. Yeah. They shouldn't be. Look, where are you? Those look fine to me. I don't know why they're I mean you got you got okay. actually you've got ones that are missing here that haven't been placed. Oh, you put glass instead of um pistons. Oh, is that what I did? Yep, on these four. Uh. So when you go down, if you just move into the next group, then you can do that. Yeah, so yeah, four, four yeah, pistons okay. are missing. Okay. Good thing you spotted that. Yeah. Oops, I now I just did the same thing. Dang. So that means we're short on pistons then, because I only oh, have yeah, two yeah. left. Good point. I, I need one here. Huh. We must have lost them along the way, because unless... Uh, I don't know. I got the exact number of pistons. I know that for sure. But... I don't have any on me. Let's have a look. Do you oh, have I any... got plenty. I got plenty back up. Yeah. Oh, okay. Okay, I was going to say if you've got... Fortunately, that's something material. I do have. There is one, two. There's the third one. Let me go over here. And break that one. Yeah, that was glass. How did I do that? I'm telling you, this is like Matica stuff. <laughs> it's tricky. Got to double, triple check a lot of the time. Yeah. So that can go. Okay. I think I got two more that I've uh, missed somewhere. According to my chat. There's one. There's two pistons missing over here, and I'm out of pistons, but I can give you we'll some. Hopefully, be able to get that. Oh, I'm almost out of redstone blocks too. Oh boy. <laughs> we are really cutting it fine. <laughs> um. Okay. Oh, I see something odd. I think you got glass down the bottom here, where there should be redstone as well. What? What am I doing? Right, I have one I have one left to do in this column. Okay, in your one you've still got two up the top where you need pistons. Yeah, correct. Uh everything is I've good got... on the other side. So you need you need two pistons. Yes, and I've got six redstone blocks, so if you're short on redstone blocks. I got one pillar left to do, so I okay. need I need like one piston. Yeah. Uh, how many pistons do you need? Two. Get that over to you. There you are. Yes, I'm going to I'm going to put them on the end stone here. Okay. And then I'm going to double check it for you. And yeah, just just two orange. missing. Yeah, okay, that's it. Okay. Good. Oh, and was there something wrong with the red? Yeah, okay, you got four redstone blocks missing over here. You I put got four pistons, redstone blocks. pistons instead of uh, redstone blocks. So that, oh. oh, we had the pistons all along then. That's where they went. Yeah, I guess we do. <laughs> and I got oh. four redstone blocks on me. Dang. It's those four there. Okay, I'll, I'll replace those. I think maybe it's because I'm uh, middle clicking, and then when I place the block... I can't see what it is because it highlights it. Yeah, middle something. middle clicking is a bit funky with this mod. I wouldn't I wouldn't trust yeah. it. Yeah. Okay, so here I had pistons. Oh. That's not good. <laughs> uh actually no, that's fine. Okay. I think that worked. I think that was okay. Yeah, that was okay. Oh. And then that one. Okay, and now I've got the four redstone blocks on me. All right. 
Okay. That's the end of Ooh. that stage. Yes. Next stage so now is we should, the middle bit. Should we... Maybe I can go around and take these things down uh, while I'm What I'd here. recommend doing first, if you just check out my stream, is um, mm -hmm. get it so that you're seeing what I'm seeing, right? Like, I think we want to build this layer by layer. So we just start with all right, a lot of hoppers going to barrels. Mm -hmm. Yeah, kind of build it up. But yeah, I think you're right. I think we can we can get rid of all of this first. Yeah, I'll do that. Oh goodness! What are you? Are you gonna continually expand your um, your temple? I don't think so. I I've built two. Kind of thinking a third might look cool, but I think I'd like to keep it a little more organic this season and just like follow your inspiration a bit. If I feel like building something different somewhere else, like go over there and build it, that kind of thing. Yeah, absolutely. It's very, I find, I don't know how you think and feel when you like play this game, but for me, it's like I, I think I trap myself a little bit into creating a list. So you get inspired by something one day, but then you feel like you have to be committed to going all the way with that idea or something. Yeah, I get that. I get that feeling for sure. Yeah, so you end up and with it, a, this like list that you think you have to do, and, and, right. and then you're not in the mood sometimes, and it's like, I'm trying to get away from that. Yeah. Totally good strategy there. I'm just, yeah, I think I'm, I'm more, I think this whole season in general has been more kind of like, um, take it as it comes, go yeah. with the flow sort of thing, which is awesome. I, I'm loving it. How, how is it though that we've all just like landed on this wavelength? I know. Isn't it weird? Impulse, impulse has an interesting theory on it that I, I think I agree with. I okay. think I think if we just look back over what's happened on YouTube over the last couple of years, uh, the whole shorts and Mr. Beastification of stuff, I think it put a lot of us into a sort of overthinking mindset where, mm -hmm. you know, we're on the grind, we're trying to optimize and make the best videos possible. And, and then that's sort of mixed with our approach to Hermitcraft in the past of like doing mega projects and making everything big and... And that just takes mm -hmm. away from the social aspect. And maybe, you know, because it's been a concurrent theme, not just in Hermitcraft, but like across YouTube, this sort of hustle mentality towards everything. Like maybe we're all just like fed up with it. And I think that might be it. Yeah. yeah. It's like uh, it, it gets to a point where I don't know if this is the right way to say it, but you just can't you just can't keep up. Yep. And so you're like, you know what? Let's just go the opposite way. <laughs> yeah. That's how I felt. Like I'm, I'm literally trying to remind myself of what what it felt like to make videos in season two of Hermitcraft. Mm -hmm. uh, that's like my benchmark, and I keep going back to it. Um, because back then, I never thought about like a thumbnail. I used to just take right, a screenshot of what I did in the last episode, which just makes <laughs> no sense anymore. I know it's crazy. And we've all been doing this a long time now. Like we're all yeah. pretty much ten years plus YouTubers. Hermitcraft's mm -hmm. been around for over ten years. And it's time to like really just enjoy each other's company and have fun, right? Oh yeah, it's it's going on 13 years for me in in wow. April. That's that's too much. <laughs> I've never done anything for 13 years. Yeah, I was thinking about this the other day. It's like you've actually got something you've done with your life that spans over a decade. Like you hear stories yeah. about this sometimes, and then all of a sudden it's like, wait a minute, that kind of applies to me with what we're doing here. Crazy. It's crazy to think about. And to think it all started like with just a it was just a hobby. Yep. <laughs> it's crazy. At what point Watching. do you feel like you could see the future? Like uh did you start to think like, oh, maybe this is a career or this is gonna be big? It was pretty early for me because um I I, I saw the momentum I, I saw that I was gaining momentum and as soon as uh I got accepted into the the Minecraft server. It was like, huh, this could be interesting. And so at the time, I'd actually gotten laid off from my job, and uh, I was uh, literally on my way to an interview, <laughs> a job interview. And I just turned around and I was like, you know what? Let's just give this YouTube thing a try and see what happens. That's and that amazing. was amazing. That was it. I turned I around that. midway midway through the drive towards to, to my interview, and I just was like, okay, I'm done here. 
That's awesome. I love that. Yeah, it was really cool. That's a real like following your gut kind of thing to do as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah. For me, actually, strangely, like I didn't get laid off, but uh, the European Union passed these uh, protect workers laws or whatever, and they didn't do that. They they basically undermined us. The opposite. Yep. Yeah. So I had half the work, and it was like already under minimum wage, because you know that's that's how they they did things. Mm -hmm. And then, um, and and then you know, like I was I was working like three weeks at a time, three weeks off or something, and YouTube was actually starting to make more money than that, and I was like, I should just give this a go, you know? Yeah. And I don't know specifically at what point, like I realized this was you know the job for the future, but before before I did that, I could see this was becoming a thing, like. If you were on YouTube and watching it grow and seeing these new things, you know, new sorts of entertainment emerge, it was it was kind of obvious this was going somewhere, right? Mm-hmm. Do you have the hoppers, by the way? Uh, I have 60 hoppers on me. Was that all the hoppers? Uh, I think so, yeah. I'm going to... Are you up the scaffold? Okay. Yep. I'm going to come up there as well and put down this lime wall. And then we can... Uh... Uh, how am I going to do this? All right, uh -huh. I'm starting to place hoppers. Nice. So talking on Minecraft, like uh, these days people don't know, but like Minecraft was the thing when it came to Minecraft SMP, right? Yeah. You were right oh, at the yeah. heart of that. Oh yeah, we were, I mean, yeah, it was the server to be on. That's for sure. And I, I got in just contest. I just won a contest. Yes, yeah, <laughs> I remember. It was awesome. Uh, oh, this is really tricky. So how do you do the layer thing with... I have it configured to page up and page down on my keyboard, and I don't, okay. know, don't know if yours will be uh, set up the same way. And, and what uh, control menu is that? Oh, right. Like, uh, uh, I'll tell you... Uh, sorry, page up and page down. Is it is it doing anything for you? Do you see a little message on your screen? Move max layer? No, I think I changed that. Hold on a second. I'm going to okay. go to the configuration menu. So you need to go to. to configuration hotkeys and mm -hmm. let's see. I think you type layer in the little search box. It's on my stream if you want to see it. Okay, yep. Yeah. Oh, then, layer mode next and stuff. Oh, oh, I know oh, what I changed that to. Layer next. Yeah. Previous. Uh, I need to get off of here though. I need you to throw me a hopper, I think. Oh, okay. Oh, you're down there now. Oh, dang. Okay. No, no problem. I'm coming up. It's right oh, okay. in the middle anyway. I'll uh, I'll step over so I'm closer. I'm just gonna read something from my uh, noises. Sure. Uh, Vast Spider two eight one Thor, thank you so oh. much for the Prime oh, Deadly Panda okay. sixty six, <laughs> and Zombie Fat Cat with cheers and biddies. Yo, X. I recently ran into a fairly new dungeon synth record that I thoroughly enjoyed. Mountain Realm, Gradui, Gradoche Ruins. I didn't see it on your music blog, so I'm sending you away. Thank you, my dude. You absolutely know that I am totally on the lookout for uh, a little bit of Dungeon Synth. I haven't listened to one in a while, so can I, like, copy that and just drop it here? Oh, dang it. I've got to write it out again. Mountain Realm Grey Shadow Ruins. Oh, check that out. I'm totally in the mood for that. And uh, thank you again. I just got a uh, record recommendation, so... Oh, nice. Always always enjoy that. Oh, I only needed one, by the way, but uh, I'll do. Well, you got all of them now. So, yeah, as a, as a viewer of Minecraft, like, what you guys were doing was just so amazing. Like, I, I was, every day, it was like, you were just buzzing to see who would upload and what would happen next, you know? It was exciting times, that's for sure. That was the, 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 the days of, like, three videos a day, too. <laughs> oh, God, yeah. <laughs> that was insane. There was a time, yeah. Now, now you can't even conceive of that. It's like, what? No. Must be not a chance. Yeah. Oh, there's so, that glass okay. pane. Hmm. So yeah, I feel I feel like though, I feel like with Minecraft, it like it went so quick. Like it 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 just it was like a moment in time, and I just feel like there's so many people like watching Minecraft the videos today that they don't realize like how Minecraft, uh, Minecraft kicked all of this off. 
And I, yeah. I think it'd be great if someone like took the time to make a proper series. Like, you know the Hermitcraft recap? Like mm -hmm. the Minecraft recap or something. Just to just to like relive it again. I would adore that. Oh yeah. That'd be so cool. Yeah, yeah. that'd be awesome. How how long were seasons as well? They because now we run seasons for like over a year, whereas I think you guys I think it was about a year. I don't think yeah. we I don't think they were too much shorter than that. Where did I leave? Oh, did you take the the uh, shulker boxes with you? Yeah, I've got them up here. Okay. I figured since this is the last bit, we're kind of um, just going to need all the materials here. Yeah. The layers thing really isn't working for me, and I don't, I'm not sure why. Um. So you changed the key, right? Assigned it to the I changed thing? them back now. I reset them to page up and page down, but nothing is happening. Like, nothing even comes up on my screen when I know that it should because I remember that it did before. Do you have, like, a keyboard lock or something on? I'm not sure they have no. those keys. Hmm. I, okay, well, I got no ideas. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. That's okay. It's fine. I'll just make do. This is why I'm never going to use Blade Matic again. <laughs> Yeah, I, I I honestly having used it a lot. Um, I think I think it might have been I can't remember who said it in one of our little group chats. It might have been Efo just sort of pointing out how. Actually, Efo doesn't use like Matica, does he? You know, there's uh, there's a few of us in, no. in the in the group that on occasion say really insightful things, and it was one of those chaps. And uh, yeah, yeah, exactly. They they made me realize that yeah, you you create a sort of um, so like you think you're getting more time because. You know, now you're using this uh, light matica and it's going to show you where to put the blocks, but it creates this feedback loop where then you start going bigger and bolder and you get mm -hmm. away from like the survival scale and now you're building crazy stuff that like, you know, and then all that time just gets eaten up by the fact that you've got light matica and you think you can do more because of it. Yeah, it's not just that. It's also you, while you're while you could be on the server actually building something from scratch or taking your time building something. You're actually not on the server. You're yeah, kind totally. of your creative world. So yes, and what I've really liked this season, and I don't know if you've been doing it, but other hermits have been using the creative server, which is fantastic because like I've actually like popped on there on occasion and just bumped into other peeps doing stuff in creative and and then oh, doing yeah. things together, which is super cool. Nice. No, I haven't even used it this season yet. If ever you need to do something, you know, just in a creative world, it's got. Um, got axiom on it i don't know if you've ever used that mod no i have i'm used, very uh, basic it? when it comes uh no oh wow, i, mean, I okay. have used it i have used it but like years and years ago for like uh, nothing basically yeah. well, these, I'm, these, uh, are, very these are much powerful like, uh, tools of creation but i do think you have to you have to have like an ambition to sort of play at a particular scale you know otherwise mm -hmm. it's I don't know. It's, again, it's it's got that similar thing to Light Matica where it'll end up being a bit of a time sink because you think you can do yeah. more. Yeah. Where did you put those shulkers, by the way? Uh, they're in my inventory. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, let me see if I can go here. Could you check? Uh, could you check the hopper at the bottom below the lime wall? Sure. I think something went into it a second ago. Well, I know it did. Uh, oh goodness, this is this is dangerous. It's so hard to wait. How do I turn off the light manica thing? M and R. M. Oh, at the same time. Yes. That didn't work either. Hold on. Oh wait, wait. I, I, mm? If that's not working, you got something. Something going on with your keyboard or something. Yeah. On it. Interesting. Is, is there any hotkey that's like what happens if you just press M on its own? That works. Interesting. Okay. But M and R doesn't. No. What's it called? The the command. Or the question. Yeah. I think render would be the word. Render. Toggle it's, all rendering. That's is that the it? one. Toggle all rendering. Okay. Ah, that worked. Nice. But it, what was the hotkey set to? You just press the button in the menu, right? Um, 
so I set them, so this morning I went and set them to hotkeys that I knew I was going to use. I don't have a number pad on my uh, keyboard. Oh, okay. So I had to kind of, yeah, I had to kind of uh, change a few of the hotkeys. So it was set to shift and nine. But, like, for example, the um, the page up, page down should be working, but it's not. But that's okay. Yeah, that is. Oh, what do you want me to check? The hopper, right? Oh, I've just, I've just yoinked the uh, block from it, so we're good. Okay, yeah, no issues. Um, I'm still placing stairs. The next ones are kind of awkward. I don't know if you want to uh, join me up here. Yep, yep. Now I'll I can see everything. Half of the stairs. So the next ones go. Uh, they sort of face inwards. I think like that is the shape. Oh, okay. And then all the way around. Looks like it. Yeah, just just a repeat of what we've already done. Okay. Oh yeah, this is uh oh wow, this is so much nicer without all the lightmatica mess in my face. <laughs> <laughs> I could I could probably do with turning that off actually, yeah. Although there's there's little buttons to press uh to place at each end, I'll take care of that. So what are your uh, what are your favorite like Minecraft memories? Um we used to do a lot of pranking. Uh, the people love pranking nowadays, and if they were around when we were doing the Minecraft stuff, we did so much pranking. Like it yeah. was, <laughs> it was ridiculous. So, the pranks are like my favorite ones. We and and then we kind of accidentally came up with games while pranking because King I remember we, yes, King of the Ladder. We made like a giant mushroom thing on top of Good's build. I think we just built like a mushroom cloud. And then to get up there, we all had to get on ladders and sort of help him take it all down after he discovered the prank. And that's how King of the Ladder started. It was just one pillar with a ladder and we would just start punching each other off. And looking back at it now, it was such a simple, silly game, but so much fun. Oh, it was, yeah. It, yeah it, like back then awesome. it would sort of become the meta in all the little communities around it. like. I think I used to like play on a server um, that wasn't Hermitcraft, and like everyone's on there playing K King of the uh, Ladder all yeah. of a sudden. I know. They, people still play it. It's, it's a fun game. Yeah. The, it's um, got no sort of beginning and end, but it's a fun game. <laughs> no scoring system, just. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. The, Ooh, the pranking, I think, I think something with pranking is just. It used to be so casual and simple. And yeah, I know. Now it's just games, super complex. Yeah, the games now become quite... I don't know. Like We, we think we can't do simple things, but we probably can. Mm -hmm. Right, I've got some buttons out of there. Um, okay, so what happens next? I'm looking at your screen can here. You, can you do a flint and steel and take care of the fire in the middle? Oh, we need even more stairs? Oh, dang. Okay, I've still got a stack. So have you got so glass? Now it's, here we go. I have a stack of stairs as well. You do the glass, the fire in the middle. I'll do these ah, the flint stairs and steel. And do you have flint and steel on you? I do. They'll be. It'll be down in my little toolbox down below. Okay. That's that's why I got my. Do you have the uh, Shulker Plus mod on? No, I do not. Oh, you can't see my beautiful Ender chests. Okay. <laughs> Wait, when you where you said when you said toolbox down below, where'd you mean? Not down down below, right? Uh, down on the endstone, yeah. Um, if you fly down it? there, you'll see them. I left them down there. I think. Oh, maybe I picked Are them up. Are you sure? I, yeah, I think sorry, I might have picked them up. Yeah. Okay. Um, in which case, I guess. Oh, I yeah. did. If you look at my stream, this is my beautiful ender chest, all neatly oh, organized wow. with all sorts of uh, <laughs> fantastical blocks. That is fancy. Took me a whole day, but it's like totally worth it because it's you sort of got one of everything at least, mm -hmm. and then you know you can keep it stocked up. And then when you go out and about, it's like if you need to craft something or need to grab a flint and steel, like you got you got one of everything in there, you know, a spyglass mm -hmm. or, or whatever. So I just have to light these uh, nether rack blocks then. Yeah, I believe so. And I think there's some ladders. Do you have the uh, schematic up for it? N not right now. Okay. Um, in which case I'll come come back to the middle and take care of that. Okay, I'm, I'm I'll do some more stairs. I still have a stack on me. Oh yeah, yeah, those need to. Okay, right. So the fire is good. What's this in the middle? Does it want a barrel in the middle? 
No, no, it doesn't. There's just some funky rendering going on here, I think, is the problem. Hmm. Oh, okay, and then there's a ladder there. Oh, I've got the ladder. Right, do you have the glass? I have some glass, yeah. If you chuck it to me, I'll do that. Okay. And here we go. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> Uh, we got to get a shulker in here. That's that's one right. bit where, like, were we given instructions in that chat? I don't think so. <laughs> I should probably drop a message in there. Yeah, I'm going to do that. In fact, I'll, I'll let you take care of that, and then I can keep my uh, okay. stream stuff all intact. Oh, that reminds so me. are we wanting to know where we put the shulker, or how? Uh, we just need to know how we how we put the shulker into the farm, I guess. How and how and where. Okay. Uh, Axel Cobra, thank you so much for three months with the Amazon Prime. Thank you for supporting the channel. Hope you're uh, enjoying a different stream today. So let's see. Oh, he did link a video for shulker transportation tips. Yeah, you, you should watch that because I'm streaming, so. I'm going to do that. Cool. <clears throat> Excuse me. Ah! Oh, gosh, I got wings. <laughs> <laughs> Just kind of remembered that right at the last second. It looks like minecart's the easiest way, and it says that just you just pass um, a minecart right next to them. Same with any other mob. Oh, interesting. I, I I'm gonna go double check my video in a bit to make sure. So that's getting that's getting the shulker into the minecart. Then Correct, what about yeah. getting it into this farm? Right. Oh oh oh, that's annoying. Oh, I got it. Oh, we're missing one here. Right, you should have two stair blocks, by the way. I need those. Uh, let's see. I do. Exactly two. Uh oh. Oh, I thought I threw it off the edge. <laughs> you're good. You're good. <laughs> I think I think the player stands here, by the way. Like I think the player in the just, middle there. Yeah, I think the player goes here. I think the fire might destroy the shulker things. Oh, interesting. So, okay. So wait, how do how do shulkers duplicate? Um, they hit each other with their bullets. So their bullets go back and forth. When they hit themselves, I think they duplicate. Okay, so if we get a shulker, would that mean we need at least two shulkers then? I think you need one. Just one. Yeah. So how would it hit? Like, let's say we get one in here. How would it hit itself to duplicate? Good question. <laughs> oh, look. <laughs> uh, the lever is probably reachable from here. So I think you go like that. Oh, cloud. Then you get in the Oh, wow. That this really is something. Is loud. Gosh. Yeah, okay. Now, I don't know if the shulker just needs to be like on one of these uh, you know what you probably just got to bring it over here and get it on a glass block yeah did That's... did um did ending credits share any more videos with us you got um the shulker transportation tip which is pretty simple um let me see if you mentioned anything about actually getting it 
need to get a shelter. Any oh, it's, okay. So here we go. It says you need to just get a shelter anywhere within the farm. Turn on the shufflers to get it in the cells. But then I think maybe turn off the shufflers initially and let it run for a couple of duplications just to ensure highest chance of, of successful duplication. Right. I'm trying to find that same message. It sounded like you're saying... We, we get it inside the chamber in the middle and turn off the shuffler for a little bit? Correct. I'll, I'll uh, copy and paste his message in uh, our chat so you can easily access it. It sounds like uh, potions of healing would be handy for the uh, shelker because they might get damaged. Uh, but let's have a look. Should we should we pop down see. below? Let's get rid of this. Okay, this thing is ready. We're gonna have to use rockets to fly up to it, I think. So, mm -hmm. well now, yeah, well, I'm pretty sure we've got everything. So, we, uh, take all of this away. <laughs> I'm okay. Right, if you want to handle brewing, let's see. What do we have? Do you have brewing materials or? <clears throat> yeah, there's a rule we're using my uh, my shulker boxes, by the way, is that you always, unless it's like a one stack thing. Oh, like the, uh, what's missing out of here? My hat. The flint and steel. If you could chuck mm -hmm. that back in. I so have like, that, yep. The, the rule is you always <laughs> leave me. one item behind. So in this one, right. there is glistering melon for health potions. So everything you need is in here. You can, uh, except for bottles. So you need some glass. And then we got water here. All right, and then that way, you know, you got everything. Okay. Uh, I will do some healing potions. Here are your two shulker boxes. Although I don't think it really matters anymore. You could, I could have held on to those, you know. We drowning no, don't. before long. <laughs> oh, that's true. <laughs> I was just about to tell you no, I need them, but this is the whole point. Yeah. <laughs> okay. We're good. Um. All right. Yeah, right. And so while you're brewing, I think I need to go watch my own video. Okay, before you go, do you have a crafting bench? Crafting bench coming up. So I can make some bottles. Got it. Oh, wrong playlist. So uh, if you're interested, dang it. What is what YouTube happened? doing? <laughs> it's like I go to click and all the buttons move and then it, then they move again and like it starts playing the video. Then it jumps to a different one. Um, what is it doing? Okay. Right, I found my episode, so that's good. Oh, yeah. No, I did do something sort of special, but now that I see it again i understand it's just you just pick it up through a wall right yeah. right i got this um i'm gonna i'm gonna nip to the toilet quickly by the way okay sounds good be right back Okay, I'm back. Alrighty. I uh, put the kettle on. 
as well. Oh, nice. Might oh, treat that's... myself to a cup of tea. You deserve it after this. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, right. Um, it's gone relatively smoothly, I think, other than my light Matica newbiness. Dude, it's 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 been good. We've we've powered through and Oh, uh might be a little short on rails. Okay. I can always craft more. Um Yeah, that's probably more than sixty four blocks away. So I don't think shulkers can teleport to rails or slabs. Right. We so can't we're just make gonna make a stone little slabs, can we? Oh, I think it's uh, bricks, think... isn't it? Yes, yeah, exactly. Actually, I'll tell you what, like you might want those for building or something. Uh do you have like any stone on you? Um, other than stone brick slabs. I have nothing. But we have end stone bricks. What do you need it for? Oh, I just, I just, some blocks like you know, like stone is a block that you always got tons of. So mm -hmm. it's like, yeah, craft it. But some blocks are more like, if you want to build them, you don't want to come back here and like mine up loads of these. But I'm, I'm just gonna oh, I turn... got a bunch. I got I got a bunch of uh, stone brick slabs already. Oh, okay, yeah, uh, we'll and, use some and of them. Stone, and stone brick slabs, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I got a bunch of them. All right, so we need those. Then we need to put rails on them, and we're gonna yep. use a furnace minecart, I think. Yep. So gonna need a little bit of coal. I need some I'm iron. Gonna here. I'm going to make six potions, actually, just to be safe. How much iron do I need? Oh, five. I mean, could we accelerate this by getting more than one in there? Yeah, uh, there's actually two at the, at the entrance, so we'll, awesome. we'll try and get two in there. The question I have for my chat, and hopefully they can help us with this... Although, you know, I don't know if you know it's like asking a Twitch chat. Like, everyone everyone will <laughs> answer don't. regardless of what they know. Um, <laughs> right, yeah. So, like, can we... What I'm thinking is, can we just use... Is it an activator rail? To, like, push them off when they get to the end. So we can build the whole rail, and when they reach the end, they'll just, like, immediately depart. I think. I think that has to be powered as well. Oh, that's interesting need to make those hmm. okay well right we'll definitely try one at a time i think makes the most okay. sense i mean we have elytra so if we get hit with these things and start floating up but we should be fine that yeah that's that's not going to be uh falling yeah no with the elytra falling's not a concern i i'm i'm just trying to think about what blocks we're using so that um Stuff they don't like, it doesn't, it doesn't to those. yeah, it doesn't stick yeah. to the wrong thing. We need uh, we need some buttons for that, I think. I'm gonna grab a few of those. So let's start at the end in. So start up there. Yeah, we wanna we wanna bring them into the farm. Mm hmm And then have them like teleport somewhere so relatively close to everything going on up there. Doc, use Ooh. activator. <laughs> Whoopsie! <laughs> Apparently, Doc used activator rails when he did his. So to pop them off. Yeah, it sounds like a good move. Okay. So. Oh, this is gonna be. Okay. Last time I did this, I had loads of scaffolding, which helped make it easy. Because we need to get the rail from like down below up, mm -hmm. and also build it out of slabs. So. This will get annoying, right. but you know, we'll figure it out. Well, um, here, here's, I'll, I'll, let's, okay, I got this, I got this. I'm gonna start. Probably, I don't want to get too close there. Um, let's start over here and let's just wing it. I, I would. Mm hmm. Here's what I, I would here's start what I further planning. back than that. I would start further back than that. No, I, I mean, I'm starting it up high here, though. Oh, you mean, like, the angle? Well, let's let's not rush to do anything for a second. Um, okay. I just... I, I, let me focus on finishing this. Uh, that's wrong. Okay. Uh, that needs to be a lever. <clears throat> right, okay. Activator rail is in, set, in place. And this one's at this height, and then it's going to be... 
uh, this right here. So like from where I am now, we kind of want it to go down diagonally. Mm-hmm. And if you try and guess it or wing it, you might end up putting it in the wrong spot. Is kind of what I'm thinking. Uh! Oh, jeez. Okay. <laughs> Maybe we can use the scaffolding and just do it awkwardly a bit at a time. I was just going to build sort of a staircase alongside of it with endstone and then just take the endstone out. Okay, you. I, I can't. I don't quite understand what you mean. So if you start doing that and then we'll see what happens. Okay. Let's see. Hopefully I understand what I mean. <laughs> that would be handy. <laughs> all right, so that's all. Ah, gotcha. Okay, so this is what I was thinking, right? Ooh, I did that uh, one wrong. Where am I at? Hang it's on, I just uh, watch watch yourself. I did a thing wrong. Maybe we put the rail on last. Yes. Yeah. So my plan was to do this: build this staircase so we can just put, place the uh, slabs alongside them. Yeah. What's what's annoying is that you got to do it backwards. So if you started right. down over there and came up, then yeah, that would work. Uh, but I have this. Oh, oh, this doesn't go all the way down. Okay. It's okay. It's fine. I'm gonna I'm gonna break this scaffolding, by the way. Okay. All right. So you know you know Scar has a thing against scaffolding. What do you mean? Why? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> he prefers <laughs> dirt, but uh, are you for scaffolding or against it? I think it's great. It is great, yeah. I really do. Um, without scaffolding, I don't know what could be done. I mean, it would. I guess it would all be done still, but so much better with scaffolding. It is. It is. Uh, the only the only thing I can say against it really is that you kind of have to learn its quirks, right? That's true. Once you get once you get that into your muscle memory, though, it can be pretty good. Absolutely. I love it. I don't know how I was building stuff with that. Well, I do know how. Just pillars. Constant, constant pillars. <laughs> yep. I mean, they literally designed it to address that problem. This was a great idea, by the way. I didn't quite right? understand what you meant, but now now I'm now I'm with you. This is this is working. I think that Enderman... Oh, no. He's, he doesn't like you. Good. He just, I'm low on he just health. wanted to smell you. <laughs> <laughs> so now I'll go up there and start uh, taking them down. Oh, dang it. No, wait. I've been placing them wrong somewhere here. Oh, have you? Oh, I placed all of once. <laughs> once I switched method, I, yeah, it was like I did it all wrong. Well, well done me. Okay. Okay, I'll start taking this. Do you have uh? Do you have the extended reach? I'm pretty sure everyone has it. Have you noticed this? I have noticed it. Yes. I welcome. I'm it. not complaining about. Yeah, it. it's so good. <laughs> It is. It's like a little extra, and actually, it makes a lot of difference. Oh yeah, I wish, I wish we had even more extended reach. Go yeah. go gadget arms. Uh, technically, in the next snapshot, we could. Uh, you got you got attributes. You can put them on tools. You can put them directly on a player. You can extend their reach. Like that's a thing that's built into the game now. If you want to do Interesting. that. Interesting. Yeah. But not like vanilla. That's more for like map makers. Oh no and no. Stuff, uh, right? vanilla is in. It's in the vanilla game. It's not a mod. Yeah. It's right, right. But I know it's what not you mean. like something yeah. <clears throat> you can't you can't grab an enchanted book or whatever. Exactly, yeah. You know what I was thinking today actually, there should be an experience enchant where um you can put it on any tool and you'd get double the experience, but then you couldn't have anything else on the uh, on the tool. Like you couldn't have efficiency or looting or anything. That's interesting. I, I think that's a nice idea, but I'm not sure if it fits in with the game because uh, have you noticed how OP everything is? Like you're always yeah, just like if you go fight mobs. Do you remember when it, you got into a hairy situation with lots of skeletons and you would check your armor yeah. to see if it broke? <laughs> like that never happens. It's just it's constantly I know. repaired. I know. Okay, right. We got we got to be now. stealth now. Okay. Ooh. Oh. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> good, good time to mention that. Uh, okay. So oh, can oh, I put oh, some stay, blocks? Stay back. Stay back. Ooh. I got it. They got need it. to go one block further forward. So uh, one at a time here. Okay. Okay. Oof. Nice. I'll let you handle it so we're not breaking the same blocks. Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna shimmy over to your side for these last two. Yep. Right. Now, uh okay. the place that we put the rail to pick it up is here. Mm-hmm. Like that. And and I've I had a lever to power it. I've got another one, that's good. So once we put a minecart on that, it's gonna come out here. Mm-hmm. 
And then we can just uh, hook it up to what we've already got. We're going to use a furnace minecart to push it along, though. Okay. And I'm out of rails. I knew we'd need, like, three or four more. <laughs> I got one. <laughs> Hang on a second. Oh, look there at that. Go. Look at that. Just about. Right. Uh, I didn't bring a minecart. Brilliant. Gotta go back oh, anyway. Dang it. So wait a minute. So he's gonna he's gonna get picked up right there in that corner and then just come backwards. Correct. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And do you have the furnace minecart on you as well? I uh, I do. Yeah, I do. Okay. Uh, Siric. Le Should we Freuks, turn that thing on so first? Or, no, no, we can't. Eight minutes ago, let him, him attach himself to the glass blocks. I'm assuming. Sorry, I missed that. Uh... I'm just wondering if we should turn that thing on first or not. Oh, uh, I don't think we should. I think we should see what happens. Yeah. I, I just, I don't know. It needs to latch onto something. Oh no! Yeah. Actually, I think. Oh my god! What did it say again? No, I think I think you might be right. I think I'm gonna go re reread that message and stop thinking. It says it says uh, we get it anywhere within the farm, then turn on the shufflers to get it in the cells, and then turn it off. Right. That to me sounds like you got to get it in there first. So we right. get it up there, yeah. we turn on the farm, then we turn it off. Mm -hmm. So we we sort of force it inside. All right, this is this is super cool. This bit because this is a different farm from what I did last time. So, um, yeah, I'm ready. When do you want to do the honors? Ah, uh, sure. <laughs> here we go. Now, is it gonna shoot me when it comes flying back through here? Oh, you want to place that on the rail? Oh, okay. You can't. You don't have to push it. Oh. oh, oh, oh. oh. Okay. Hey, ready? Yep. There it is. Oh, it stopped. Uh, it's doing a thing. Oh, we can't push it. We have to we have to use um there we go. Hey. That'll take it all the way up. Okay. Alright, watch out for those bullets. Yes. Yeah. Can I block them with a the shield? You can, right? Dude, it it came back down and then got pushed oh, up again. It, it went up there. It's in there. Nice. And the mine came back out. Awesome. Do you want to um grab another one while we're here? I think we can do it. I think we can push uh, two in. Yeah. I think so, right? It's it's going to be there on, on the other side, I'm assuming. Yeah, I reckon this will work. Okay, so... Pop all of that back. Uh, powered rail. Lever. And... Okay. Would you like to Mind do the honors again? <laughs> sure. <laughs> sure. There it hey, is. we got and another that one. one. went straight off. Woo! Yeah. I'm floaty. Oh, you're... You're gonna float a little bit. Oh, 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 oh. That one is really going. Oh, oh here we no, go. it's stuck. It's stuck. Bam. There we go. Woo. Let's oh, see it needs it another push. Pushes off. Yeah. And oh, yeah. It's in. It, it teleported. Fantastic. Right. Okay. All right. So next, so now next we up go... is rockets, right? Yes. Let's fly up there. I think you should do this yourself, by the way. So okay. I'm doing it. Okay. Oh, boy. Here we go. And where's that lever again? Just land in the middle and look up for the soul sand. You want to be in the section below. So pop down, look up. Yep. Oh, I see up. it. Ha! It's on. Right. Ooh. Okay, are they... Did they get teleported? Oh, oh. Yeah, oh. you want to hop inside. You want to hop inside that area. Okay. Well, I'm definitely they're in. inside. They're in. Are they? Yeah, yeah, they're doing it. Okay. Now, we might start to see some I got hit. That's, that's... Okay, so they're... Oh, whoa, whoa. Oh, I see. That's weird. Who They're hitting floating? each other. I think the fire was... All right, go back in. Yeah. And make sure you're on the glass panes all the way down. Yeah. And, and shimmy over so you're under the ladder, I'm going to guess. Uh, okay. Right. You're not getting hit now, right? I don't think so. Okay, so just stay there. I think the shulkers are going to, like, damage each other a lot. <laughs> okay. And then I think maybe it's when they die they actually duplicate. Oh, I see. This is one of the things. When you build other people's farms, you tend to like not right. learn the deeper mechanics. So I, I don't fully I I know how it works. Hey, some... first shells, first shells. Did we get duplication? Yes, yes, there's one over here. Right, now there's two in the farm. 
Oh okay. no, there's oh oh they are duplicating. They are duplicating okay, all over the place. Where where are the shells going? Because I don't see them anywhere. They're landing in the hoppers and going to the thing down below. To the barrel. Yeah. This is your life now, by the way. <laughs> you just stay here. It's it's noisy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fortunately for me, I'm using the camera, so I don't have to put up with all those piston sounds. Yeah. Oh yeah. Here, I'm gonna turn if that down wanna, a little if bit. If you've got free cam and you just want to like put it above the farm. Um, yeah. Guess who doesn't have free cam? Uh, Listen, I keep things very simple. <laughs> that's fair enough. Well, let me tell yeah. you what I'm seeing. Like on occasion, all of a sudden, there's like shulkers teleporting to the bits outside, and okay. then and then they teleport like into this chamber area and they stay there right because they're shooting at you and so uh -huh. right now you've got like one on your right two in front of you one behind you and yeah when they die i think they duplicate and eventually find their way back in this is a really cool farm really awesome cool. i like it this is great so um i'm gonna step out here for a second yeah you might want to i'm not sure if you want to turn off the thing up above. I don't know what the shulkers are going to do. I think they can only see you when they're inside that area. Which How come I can't... Is oh, that over no, there? No. Oh, I see why. Okay, so... I'm now doing the risky thing of like trying to get rid of my rail. Oh, okay. Okay. No shulker has spotted me, so I think... Oh, there, there we go! There we go! That's what I was talking about! I, I, I was, was hit. About. I was hit. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. Yeah, I've been hit too. So, if that... Hmm. Okay. And then collection is just right down there? It's the lime... The hopper above the lime wall. I think the idea with the lime wall is that you would attach a bunch of barrels or something. Gotcha, yeah. With or that, though, two. you're going to want to make it, like... Uh, Spawnproof? Uh, you know, like you put you put buttons on the side of the barrels. Mm -hmm. Yep. Yeah, you know about that. Okay. Yep. So technically, there should be some uh, shulker shells in that hopper. Yep. Yep. There's definitely some in there. Oh! 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 Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! I'm gonna die. I'm gonna water, die. Go to the water. Go to the water. I, I'm in the water. In the Stay water. Stay in the middle. Stay in the middle. Heal up. Eat oh food. my good! Get out of here! This is why we had water. <laughs> Always water. Oh my goodness! I didn't hear him either because I had to turn my sound my sounds down. <laughs> I don't know. Oh, he's back! He's back. Okay. Get out of here, guy. Hey. Finally. So isn't it going to be a little bit of a risky business to get up there and put down um, uh, a barrel? I don't think so. I think what you want to do is turn the farm off, and then all the shulkers are inside it. And then it should be right. just simple to do whatever, you know? Gotcha. Okay. Should we do that next, then? Do you want to add some storage? Yeah, we might as well. Do you have anything in your ender chest? Or am I the one with all the supplies? You have all the supplies. <laughs> <laughs> I uh, I think I... You know, I'm good, actually. I've, I've got plenty of wood, so we can craft anything we need. Yeah, okay. We're good. We're good. Just actually, a couple we, barrels, probably We could use probably enough. decorated pots. I don't know if they can teleport to those. Oh... Yeah, here we go. Here's the yeah. here's the new way of doing things. Right, so still got to make a bunch of hoppers. Uh, do we need a bunch, or you want to like bring them all the way down here? Is that what you're thinking? I'm gonna put I'm gonna put um <laughs> some some of your stuff into here. Yeah, yeah. You can here. I'm gonna. Don't worry. I got you. You need wood. Don't worry. I'm part of the wood collective. Oh, okay. But I just can't provide can't provide you with any right now. Got ya. Got ya. <laughs> But in the future, you just you just say the word. Say the wood. Say the wood. That logo that Doc uh, shared yesterday. Were you around <laughs> at that point? I was. Yeah, yeah, Dude, I was. That was I, I, like, I looked at it and I was like, this isn't... Wait, where's the controversial thing? Oh, wait a minute. Oh, dear. <laughs> it takes a while. Uh, okay, so now I need iron. Hoppers. Uh -huh. Right, so I've got scaffolding, I've got hoppers, I've got pots, and then I need buttons to see if they go on the decorated pots. This is interesting. Okay. I'm below it. I got a, Do you reckon I got you a could go up there here. and turn it off, by the way? 
Yeah, yeah, I can do that. Oh yeah, and then let me know what the message is for sure. The message says, okay, hold on, let me go and do this first. God, it's so loud. I know. Okay, it's off. You have 10 shulker shells. That's it. That's all. But hey, you, the bad. longer you leave it running, That's not bad. you'll get more and more shulkers. <laughs> I was only in there for like, I was only in there for like three minutes. So yeah, the enough. message said, the timing on one of those pistons looks off. So he must be watching your stream. Oh, interesting. Um, if you hop up, so they can't see you and stop shooting in brackets and stop shooting. They leave the shuffler so the shulkers end up in the cells. It should it should all be safe to leave. You, you send me that message and I'll read the text to myself because I, I, I need to I think I need to read that slowly just to make sure I follow each thing. Sent. Thank you. Get to that in just a second. X, read your Twitch chat <laughs> is the next message. <laughs> ah. I mean, there's a lot of people saying, oh, I love beef and B-dubs. They give serious unhinge dad uncle vibes. Oh, now I know how to fix the farm. <laughs> <laughs> this yeah, looks then, really cool, actually. And, and then around here is where you probably want to, like, some chests or whatever yeah yeah <laughs> i like it the design is awesome in itself i'm more of an aesthetics kind of minecraft player and this is pleasing my aesthetics yeah it's got a it's got a like it's got a vibe about the way it's laid out right uh this message then timing on one of the pistons looks off so if you hop up they can't see you and stop shooting and leave the shuffler so the shulkers end up in the cells. It should all be safe to leave. I think that's what we've actually done. But I, I, I they, they're not telling me. I don't think they're telling me how to fix the piston thing. I don't think so either. Let's, I'm going to double check the schematic. So all the piston timings up here look good. All the repeaters. Mm -hmm. And the clock all looks fine. Uh, all of the pistons are set up the same way at top and bottom. So that yeah, he said just check the repeater timings are all the same. Yeah, they are. They're all... They're all good. Hmm. Um, yeah, so... We've turned this thing off. There's Look, there's one outside of it. I don't know if... You, oh, again, you don't have free cam, do you? Never mind, never mind. I was uh, pointing out some observations. It's okay. I'm back on top here just checking everything. It looks like it. Should I, should I go turn it back on and get back in the hole? Yeah, yeah. Let's leave it running for like a minute. Okay. Forgot turn a button this volume on the observer down again. to prevent a TP. Nope. It's all good. There's also nothing up there. I think the pistons might be okay. He just messaged saying it might, it might, it might just be him. Yeah, I mean, I'm, I'm looking like all over the place. So mm -hmm. now, now that I'm looking up and still, it looks like all the pistons are firing together. Okay. Uh, huh. I'll just sit here for like, I'm gonna sit here the whole time I'm having lunch. It's a good oh. idea. Yeah. Get all the farming. As long done. as I don't, as long as I don't die. Should be good. Um, I would recommend putting a beacon here. Like, you know, what? like a just-in-case beacon. Oh, like a regen yeah. beacon? Yeah. That's a good idea. I need a beacon. I need two beacons now, apparently. Let's see if I can't help with that. Top of player... Oh, trap door on top of player chamber is what we forgot. Oh, that, I don't think that was in the schematic. I don't think so. Um, but I can't do that unless... Oh, wait. I, I guess I could put it on top of the ladder here. Let me see if I can get that done before I get hit. There we go. And they can't spawn on that because it's um, a block. You have to build a full-size beacon just for the regeneration, don't you? Got oh, do that. you really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> That's okay. <clears throat> It'll get done. 
I guess it means I've got to put this in a different place. Is all. Shout out to what's the name on YouTube? I know it's Flash Heart. Ending credits. Ending credits. Oh. Shout out. Ending credits. Shout out to you for this awesome looking design, if, which hopefully um, will produce enough shulker shells for everybody. Yeah, ending <laughs> ending is watching. So if you just want to send me a link to your channel, I'll put it into my Twitch chat. Let's see. Um, one here. Well, this was great. Wait, what's one, two, three? Oh my goodness, my throat. What's oh, the, I um... don't like this void over here. <laughs> How do we get back? I don't. Uh, what's the coordinates? Zero zero. <laughs> oh, it's just zero, zero zero. Yeah, it's the end, right? Don't we have to go? Don't we have to go through one of those little tiny portal things? Oh yeah, if you want to find one of those, then sort of head back towards zero zero and hope you find one on the way, and then just like yeah. make note of it. I okay. guess that should be fine. Yeah, I didn't think to do that. To note that down. Yeah, you could you could set up infrastructure to get out here, right? Like a rail line, but the thing is you always got mm -hmm. your wings, so you just you just end up That's flying. true. Well I don't I technically don't have wings yet, because these are the uh the borrowed wings. I gotta put them oh, back. Yeah. But well, I'll hey, go there's, end rating. Yeah, there's, look, there's one over there. Uh, is it is I'm gonna it not go taken? I'm gonna go get it for you. If there's one there, <laughs> I'm getting it for you right now. <laughs> do you think it do you think it hasn't been raided? Let's have a look. Oh, I it's been it raided. I knew it. I knew it. It's too good to be true. Oh, well. I'll get one. Oh, and there were you know health potions here. I'm going to AFK here for <gasps> an hour or two. Or Gosh, more. And then I'm going to go grab an elytra and then start selling these shulkers. And you're welcome to take as many as you like. As, Thank you. As, long yeah, as, you don't, awesome. as long as you don't take all of them out of the shop. I'll let you stock up and stuff first, because I don't need yeah, any yeah. immediately. But later in the season, I'll um I'll need a lot. Awesome. That's for sure. I might even use the farm myself. That's all right. Oh yeah, absolutely. It's yours. It's half you. It's mostly yours. You did most. <laughs> I'd say, I did twenty percent of the building, and you did eighty. Oh, did I make a mistake? Uh oh. No. Oh god. I I think I forgot to double check where the beacon was, but I didn't get it wrong. So you should now be fine to AFK. Okay. Sweet. Oh, yeah. I'm getting it. Nice. Getting the regen nice. and resistance. And you got... Oh, stack already. Nice. Really? Nice. Yeah. How That's much? Uh, how many items do those um, uh, ter terracotta pots hold? One stack of the same type of item. They're, they're there okay. just to let the items flow down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I'm just curious if it gets backed up, uh, but we should be You'll be, you'll be There's good. Plenty of, I mean, if, yeah, if yeah. it gets backed up, you've got a really good problem. <laughs> yeah, that's true. That yeah. is true. Uh... All right. Well, I'm going to go grab some lunch. Yeah, man. This is good fun. Yeah, no kidding. Thank you blast. so much for helping me with this. I could not have done this alone. That's for no sure. problem. I, mean, I might have been able to, but it would have taken me days. Yeah. <laughs> Happy to help, man. Have a, have a nice All lunch. Right. Appreciate it. See you later. Bye-bye. All oh, right. Uh, we had a noise in the air. Hof is here with a raid. Thank you, Hof. Thank you for the raid. Welcome, all the raiders. Uh, you've come over an interesting time because we've just gotten done building the farm that you can probably hear above my head, making a bunch of noise. Now we're going to tidy up, go back to the base, restock, do a couple of little odds and sods. Um, yeah, all right. So that's all of my... Why do I feel like I've got more food than I should have. Hmm. Uh, where's my scaffolding? It's in here. As is my rockets. Probably not going to need all of them on me right now. Cool. Ending credits in the chat saying design unreleased. I might get released in the future, but I have a big backlog. Uh, let me go check. There you are. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to pass this on to my mods for them to put into the chat. It's in our, uh, our uh, Twitch channel thing. They'll know what I mean. On the discords, that's the one. That's the one. Yeah, I think I think we're good. I think we're good to pack up now. So this thing in there. Uh huh. Why am I not seeing? Oh, it's the wrong way around. That's why. 
That is how you stay nice and organized, peeps. You have a plan and you stick to it. Right, so we're heading out. Just heading back home. Then we did a job. Now, I, you know, I could take some shulker shells. The thing is, I've already got a couple of stacks lying around. I'll tell you what, I will actually... Uh, nah, I really don't need it. But uh, we'll remember this spot. It's like... Minus nine... Wait, there you go. Oh, there's one more thing that I needed to do, right? One more really important thing that I needed to do while I'm here. Okay, I need to go a little further. Oh, I really do not like standing here. This is a bad place to stand. Because. Um, maybe go this way a little bit more. God, this is precarious. Right, we're going to type slash inhabitor. Add. Two. Oh, wait. Is it coordinates first? Two. Hmm. Uh, let's just go to the other corner. What we're doing will preserve this area from being pruned. Okay, need to go a little further back. And maybe like here. Okay, so from there to there, we're going to put... I think it's 2,400 like that. But just to be on the safe side, I'm just going to go like a ridiculous amount. Successfully updated inhabited time for 12 chunks. So the 12 chunks that this farm is inside of now have a really high inhabited time and won't get pruned, which is cool. Which is very cool. All right, chat, you got my attention now. I know y'all been hanging out there the whole time and I've been mostly ignoring you because I've been chatting with beef. So uh, time to say hello. Would you ever consider doing another amplified train season? I would absolutely go for it, but I'm pretty sure the rest of the hermits wouldn't. It's uh, probably the main issue there. Let's try and wing the 40-40 a little bit. And I think we, we want to get to like zero. Oh, look, you can even see where we're heading to. Wow, that, that farm's really close by, actually. That's really good. That's really good. Ah! Oh, I thought I was going to be so pro landing that. I was like, yeah, I'll fly straight into it. Nope. Whew. Jevin wants 10,000 block radius not to be pruned for elytra farming. We had a chat about it yesterday and... Uh, it's 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 gonna the end will get pruned. It has to it has to happen really. It's just it's such a big part of the world file size and it limits the amount of backups we can have and yada yada yada. People like to go end busting, you know. Lord Cryptid, thank you ever so much for 34 months. Oh 34, nice. How've y'all been today? I've been good. I don't know about the rest of the chat. What pruning is question mark? Pruning is where we cut out some of the world so it can be refreshed or preserved for like um so doing the overworld is more about cutting away areas that players explore because if they explore them over and over again it gets harder to figure out where everyone actually did meaningful stuff in the world because otherwise the world download is going to be like 15 gigabytes or more at the end of the season so in order to give everyone a, a reasonable sized world download, we have to regularly maintain it. This means that some areas will get pruned and simply explored again, which is fine because um, it, it just it just means that it doesn't accumulate inhabited time and then it becomes difficult to figure out if someone did something there or not. Right, the brewery. We have buttons in one of these. I'm pretty sure we do. Uh, wings will go back in here. Rockets will go into there. Uh, slabs possibly go in here. Endstone I think was full. And pruned places get regenerated with new generation and whatnot. Correct, yeah. Thing is though, when it gets regenerated... And someone goes there, it's like fresh again. So it's easy to spot. Oh, look, players are just flying over this area. 
exploring for stuff. If you don't prune it, later on it's more like it looks like people have played in it because it's been flown over so much. So regular pruning um, gives you that kind of advantage. Right, I've taken off my hat so that can go back in there. Now what were the things we need to replenish? I need to replenish my iron. Um, that's kind of it though, I think. That's kind of it. Cybot says lag. Y'all getting... Oh, wait. Are we getting the, the... The... Oh, my God. We're getting it again. That hasn't been a while since it's done that. So let's go and see if it's the same culprit again. Um, right now, it's not updating to tell me. I can see... Ah, uh, it's the same culprit again. And it doesn't like to be ended. Now, when I do that, we should be good. Let's see if we're better again, right? Okay. So how long that lag been going for? Because I like let me know if it comes up again. Because I, I think I know now what causes it. Um Anyway. What are we doing? Uh gonna go get iron and, and check my little list of things to do. Where's my stream list? Oh, I did that, and I did that. That's good. That'll take quite a lot of time. That's something we can do very quickly. Uh-huh, okay. So, who who here knows if Joe lets people mine ice from his area? I think he would... Like, Joe's the sort of person that would say yes. If you were like, hey, Joe, could I come over and, like, take all your diamonds out of your... Uh, and a chest, uh, not yet, your chest, it's for a video. Joe would probably, you know, Joe's always a good sport. He'd be like, yeah, go on then. <laughs> no questions asked. I think he'd let me come over and take, I've gone to the wrong place. Uh, he'd come over and let me take some, some iron, I think. Uh, ice. Oh, gosh, words. If you write him a poem first. Yeah, if I wrote, wrote Joe a poem first, then I could, yeah, yeah. I used to write poetry when I was a teenager. I've always wanted to write one again. I've always wanted, like, a reason. Hey, Hypno! Ooh. Hello! Hi! What's How's this? How's it going, Azuma? <gasps> you got a mailbox! Well, it's partially installed. Like, some of the redstone stuff looks like it's there, but there's, like, oh. no hole that drops down. Uh, so I guess it's in progress right oh, now. Oh, man, they're lazy, these, these mail yeah, people. Yeah, I they're know, on a right? Break. What the heck? <laughs> <laughs> well, let me know when it's up and running so I can send you some spam. What? What are you up Wait, to anyway? What? Uh, just. Well, I saw that this uh, mailbox was kind of partially installed, so yeah. I'm just kind of like uh, setting up, uh, making it look a little bit nicer out here. I just need to get some filler blocks real quick. Cool. But... It looks awesome, man. Do you have a farm for all of this quartz? For the quartz? Yeah, yeah. the farm is right over here in the dirt. Oh, you're doing it that way. Ah. Yeah, we've got the old villager action. Uh, do you have a do you have like a mending villager by any chance? I don't. I don't. I don't have any librarian villagers. Because they used to be at spawn and now they're gone. Yeah, I think Cleo has them all. You're going to have to yell at her if you want them. Actually, oh, uh, have you visited the kitty cafe? Oh, yeah. Get a cup of tea. Get a mending yeah, book. Cup of... Exactly. That's what you should do. Oh, I'm totally going to do that. That's... Oh, thank you. Yeah. I need it for my wings, which I don't ever use, so I'm sure they yeah, get Yeah, neither use. do I. I. Yeah, Hypno doesn't fly. <laughs> no, no, no. I don't I don't even have an Elytra. Yeah, no, that's just that's just, I'm imagining things, that's what that is. Exactly. Hi. Do you have a do you have a fast horse? I'm <laughs> Ren just raided me. Uh, oh, what, you're being what were you raided. Asking? Yeah. Oh, you're streaming. Raid. Perfect. I can I can raid you as well in a little bit. Oh my goodness. I'm just you gonna guys. go steal iron from you first. So fair exchange. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, feel free to take all the iron. Uh, were uh, you asking me something? I got uh, distracted. Uh, just there. just the horse. I want to encourage everyone this season to get a fast horse and use it to get around. Like we can, oh, we can build stables. Yeah, yeah. We can build roads to ride them on. Like, I actually have a horse right here. Uh, check this horse out. Did you know that there's netherite armor in the game? Really? Netherite horse armor? Yeah, check it out. Oh my... Dude, Netherite horse! When did they add that? I don't yeah, remember that one. I know, right? <laughs> oh my god, they had so much stuff I can't keep up. 
Does it make right? it faster? This guy's zippy. Yeah, yeah. The Netherite horse armor uh, removes fall damage and makes it a little bit faster than every other horse. Dang, that's so cool. I guess um, since it's Netherite... Oh, yeah. I didn't think about this. Um, it'll be... Where did it go? Here we go. Wait, wait, whoa, 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 It'll be fine, won't it? <laughs> oh, don't walk let's, into let's it. Not be, let's not be hasty here. Oh, okay. You don't want me trying that one out. I see No, 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 no. I see how the, the armor might not burn, but the horse will. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, brilliant. Right, I'm going to... I got a couple of errands to run. I'm going to send my peeps over to you when I'm done, Hypno. All right, sounds good, dude. What are you, doing, uh, what are you doing in your stream today? Uh, we might be going to find ourselves a uh, deep dark and uh, maybe find the armor trim there. I kind of want to get the, the whole trim action going on. Dangerous adventures ahead. Yeah, like maybe. We'll see. Cool. All right, I'll send my peeps over in a bit. All right, sounds good, dude. Cool. Take care. Yep, no problem. Oh, there you go, peeps. There you go. Right, before we wrap up my stream, though, I want to go get some ice and I want to um, get some more iron. Let's just fill off a shulker box. Because <laughs> I'm going to get this much or more over the course of the season, right? Like, that's going to happen. Let's just do it now. Hypno ain't short. All right, he's the exact same height as me, apparently. X should have offered to pay for it with his diamonds. Oh, the netherite. Oh, right. The, my air quotes diamonds got you. I think Hypno has a portal here, by the way. Cold, callous hands. Thank you for 18 months, my dude. Appreciate your support. Hope you're uh, enjoying. Enjoying the stream. The stream. Uh, uh, this is different since I was last. <gasps> this is gorgeous in here. Oh my god, the trapdoor and the quartz goes together so well. Look at this. This is beautiful. Oh, I love it. I think it's the portal down here. Hypno probably thinks I'm following him now. There, there was a portal in Hypno's house. I know it. Oh, this is gorgeous, though. Jevin helps with the interior. Jevin did a mighty fine job. Clearly, I don't know where I'm going. Oh, look at this. This actually might be my resource pack, those uh, slabs. Well, Hi. hello. Do you have another portal? I do. It's upstairs. Let me... It's right this way. Follow me. Follow me. Did it used to be downstairs? Uh, it used to be on this level, and then the this floor got redone by Jevin, and yeah, then oh, I needed man. a new spot for it. So it's upstairs now. This is beautiful. These in like quartz and cherry. What a good combo. I agree. Next one over. Uh, I, I'm just trying some walls here. Probably gonna tear these down. But oh yeah. Death careful. And sadness. Okay. Careful. That is, that is some definite death and sadness right there. <laughs> <laughs> I will avoid that. All right. Yeah. Thanks, dude. Yeah. No problem, dude. Yeah, I wasn't going mad. There was a portal in here. Right, now Joe's area is in this direction. Always love to see quartz used. Really underappreciated blocks is Joland. I think I think quartz's problem is that it's a little too It's not it's not shiny, it's marbly, isn't it? It's it's just a little too pristine that it doesn't fit with too many other blocks. And the ones that it does, I think it kind of detracts you into a bit of a novel area. Um, it's hard to put it against your more traditional building materials, let's say. Right, now this right here, I believe, is a map of the biome that Joe is building his project in. Or, or it's a layout for the project as a whole. Let's just go and pop through here and see what we find on the other side. Hey, we're being raided by Impulse! Impulse, thank you so much for the raid, my dude. Appreciate it. Oh, look at that. Here we go. Here we go. Now, I'm pretty sure that Joe has been farming up this ice and flattening the land. I think it'll be fine to take a pillar from around here. Although, I don't see a lot of ice in these. Thanks, Impulse. Appreciate it, my dude. Welcome, all the raiders. We are... Uh... We had an amazing stream, actually. We were with Vintage Beef. And we built farm in the end. I can see bits of it have been chopped down. I think it's going to be good to pinch from here. Yeah, we built a shulker farm in the end together. It was a blast. We uh, had a good time hanging out. Um, Really cool project. Really cool project. Look at that. Yeah, okay. 
I'm going to... I'm not going to be in beacon range, but we'll have instant mine. I'm going to get a few stacks. Maybe not even that, because... Oh, I think I, if I get 10 stacks... Then I'll have enough to make a stack of blue ice. Yeah, and then I'll get a stack of ice and that will fill up my ender chest. So, I now have a long list, thanks to my ender chest overhaul, of things that I just need to go out into the world and do. So, it's really nice to just have a little something to do on stream. Um, sub to Mumbo, thank you for 15 months. Uh, enjoying the vids and streams so far in Season 10. Glad to hear it, my dude. Unread Sky 858991 Thank you for subscribing. Thank you, thank you. Does Beef stream, says G JT Leo. Beef is not a streamer. You know, there's the in our group, there are people who just don't stream, and that's fine. I really do think it'd be cool to see them just stream on occasion, though. Like, I don't think you have to stream on a regular basis. If Beef did a stream, I'd love to tune in and check it out, because streaming is a little different from your regular video content, right? And it's always just interesting to see how people are different between the two. So, like, you know, there's some hermits whose episodes I might tune in and watch. I watch most of it through the recap, though. Um, and then there's some whose streams I might tune in and watch because they're, like, different vibes, you know? You have crafting tweaks to revert blue back uh, to ice. We do not. We do not. I, I would like that. That would be a nice convenience because then you would effectively be storing a lot more ice in your shulker box, right? Which could be super handy. Uh, but I was working on a contraption earlier today and I literally used every little bit of ice that I had. I had like seven pieces and the contraption used the whole thing. So it was like, okay, time to restock. Oh, apparently this ice is not for mining, but for aesthetics. Thank you for telling me. I will now halt my operation. I'm glad we've only like done a few little bits. Let's go find somewhere that is for mining then. I don't know where that would be. Oh my goodness me. Look at... Is Joe putting like everything away here? Are these the chickens? Somewhere on the server there's like 600 chickens. Of course lag. That is a beautiful bit of landscape. So where do I go? Where do I go to... To mine the other ice then? Or maybe I should just leave it at that. A chest beacon. Oh yeah. Kinda. Kinda got that shape, doesn't it? Beef space has a lot of chicken. Yeah, it could be it could be someone else's. Um is there a spot? For mining ice. Can anyone in chat tell me? Lots of you telling me not to mine it. Is there a spot dedicated to mining it? I don't have to do this today, you know. So, it's just a case of finding out. If we're not sure, we'll go back. Unread Sky 858991. Thank you for your cheers and biddies, my dude. Appreciate you subscribing and uh, supporting the channel with the cheers and bits. This is a really cool area. Dang it. I, I, oh, I've done wrong, haven't I? I really... <laughs> I thought I saw him, like, you know, in a stream, mining it. I've, I've been mistaken. I'll, I'll just leave it at that. We can get the rest of the stuff another time, you know. Max Trax says hollow out on Iceberg. That's that's a smart idea, but I think I'd rather check in with Joe now. Now that I've uh, made a mistake here. Oof, we go that way. I think we're going the right way. Hey. Uh, Kiro Tukan says, it's been a while since you caught me live. Oh, welcome back. Season 10 of Hermitcraft. Hey, there's horses out here. Alright, back to the base we go. You can ask Mumbo for ice. He needed it for his base. Yeah, I actually asked Mumbo for ice for the first bunch that I got. And then... I think I bumped into Tango and Scar, and Scar gave me some. Something like that. Iskal tried to make the area he mined look naturalish while he finished. Ah, oh, I see. Okay. Yeah, we should probably get that established then. If we're allowed to do that or not. Hide your horses, people. 
Well, you know, I, I could have perhaps at some point gone and done some breeding, but, you know, I've been given name tag, so. Now I've got name tag. Don't need to breed any. Got the fast one already. Oh, the spikes were Joe's last thing to mine as they provide a nice backdrop. Oh, so. Oh, hello, kitty cat. Hello. It was like a priority thing, like, let's do everything else first. Anyway, I, you know, I'm not going to mine anymore, you know. I'm not going to do any more. Did I see something move over there? I didn't. Right, I'm getting tired eyes. I've been at the computer too long. I need a break. I need a break, people. Um, if you'd be so kind as to check out my music, Soul Side Eclipse, if you've been here before, you've probably heard me say it a bunch of times and you're getting annoyed. <laughs> uh, I'm going to keep bringing it up, but if you're new and you haven't heard it before, please do go take the time to check it out on Spotify or Apple Music or a streaming platform. Just search for uh, Soul Side Eclipse. And see if you like it. As you know, though, um, we're going to go raid Hypnotize today. So I'll be sending over to Hypno now. Thank you, everyone, for tuning in. Have a great rest of your day. Let's get that raid running here. And there it is, all good to go. Thank you, peeps. And I'll see you all later.